a pork, what is it? Uh, um, it's like a pork bowl or something like that. Oh God, my back. Lord have mercy. Or matter of fact, just tell me what y'all eating today. I'll, I'll probably get some ideas or something. I don't know what to eat. I don't know what to eat. I ate a pork chop yesterday and I regret it. I ate some pork chops and I regret it. Poke, poke bowl. My stomach. And my stomach started throwing gang signs. I was like, oh no, homemade tacos, a bagel. Damn, I don't have no bagels. My stomach started sounding like a fight sequence in the Matrix. I was like, oh no. It was like, meow, 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 meow. I'm like, oh God. Kimchi ramen. Ooh. I miss kimchi. I need to go get me some food. That'd be sweet. That sounds so good. Corn tortillas. Not the American tortillas. That's one thing I, I it's wild. Cause like, I've always been a firm believer or a firm per, a person who's very firm on like wanting to eat food. That's like culturally accurate. But the only thing I just can't get with is corn tortillas. I think I'm just too far gone with flour tortillas. And my maybe it's just my taste buds just too accustomed to flour tortillas. I can't do corn tortillas. It just tastes nasty to me. I tried. I tried. So I was like, you know what? I give up. Just give me a flour tortilla. I can't do it. I could get jiggy with everything else. That is, and that be culturally accurate. Some corn tortillas, it just has a nasty taste to me. It's so good. You try to throw it down. So I'm always willing to try some food and see how I feel about something before I make a, I don't understand how people make decisions about things that they never tried or you got so much to say, but you never tried it, you know? Um, drunk as fuck in Inglewood. They know how to cook it right for real. I mean, that's actually the last time I had a real taco when I was in LA. <laughs> they had us at a food cart that the line be all around the block. And they was like, yeah, we, we were drunk. And they took us to a food cart at two, three o'clock in the morning. The last time I've been to LA was October. We was partying, 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 and we was mad drunk. And they was like, let's go to the food cart. And that food was so good. I was so mad because I actually overpurchased and couldn't, I couldn't eat all of it. And then I didn't have nobody like with me, with me to like eat with me. So I was like, oh my God, this is going to go to waste. I can't eat this. LA is always a good time. It's always a good time and good vibes. When I go, I always meet some great people or I meet up with great people that I know already, or like, it's always good vibes. When I go to Los Angeles, I miss it so much. Like I started getting sad. Cause it's like a, a either a rapper or a singer on the timeline. And she was in this hotel room and I knew exactly what hotel room that was. And I just got mad sad. I'm like, I miss LA. <laughs> They was like, oh, that hotel, because the hotel room has a very distinct look. And I was like, I miss that. Ho I, I don't even miss the hotel so much. That hotel was very nice. If it, it had a lot of um personality, but I just missed being in LA. I'm like, bro, I miss LA. San Francisco is a whole different vibe, but I love it. I haven't been to San Francisco in over four years. We used to go to San Francisco for The Sims. Um, the Sims studio is in San Fran. So the few times that I've been to San Francisco was for the Sims. Um, and I, I miss it. It was nice. It was a nice, a very nice experience just to get away, get away from the computer, get out of the house, get on a plane, just go. And you get to talk to the devs and they're there. Yeah. 
when the packs will come out. So like we, um, cats and dogs and get famous and like these different pack releases, we would go out there and it was cool. You get to know the um, developers and the people that work behind the game. I remember rolling up in this in the studio like, um, what so what are we gonna do about these skin tones? And um some of the employees laughing at me. I'm like, who's responsible for these ashy ass skin tones? I never knew. Yeah, EAHQ is in San Francisco. And um it was a great experience. Great people. Weather was nice, the vibes was nice. But I used to be like, who did these skin tones? Where are they? Point me to them. I need to meet you. We need to talk. Yeah, I was, they was laughing at me so bad, but I was so serious. I'm like, we need to have a discussion because why do black people look like this? And, you know, I, and it resulted in some meetings and some discussions. And then from that came the updates, but it was fun. It was funny. It was great. You have to people be like, oh, you call. No, you have to. You got to call people to task when there's something that you love. You got to say something. You can critique the things that you love. Um, And I do feel like when we have discussions about diversity in gaming, there's like a subsection of like weird gamers who think that because we say diversity in gaming that every corner of every game must check off boxes for marginalized groups. And it's like, no, that's not the case, but their story should be at least included. Sometimes it can't always center the same two or three demographics all the time. And in a game like this, where we supposed to be creating little simulated people, we should be able to create whatever we want to create without having to have an excessive amount of mods to do so. Like, they be like, oh, we don't need black people in every video game. They need to be in a video game where you playing a life simulator. You know what I'm saying? Like some, some games may be based on the setting and the story. You won't see certain groups of people or certain things, but like in a life simulator, everybody should be able to simulate their damn life. Thank you for speaking out for us. You are now my favorite streamer. I'm weak. People be scared of some melanin. Yeah, even up until now, they're on the timeline talking about like how we still don't have any black American women in a lot of the competitive games that we play. Like Overwatch has yet to have a, a black woman, a black American female character, Valorant. It's like, and I'm like, that's intentional. That's very intentional. Black people in my game, you saying that to be funny, but like, that's literally how people are talking. Like, that's how people are behaving. Like, why would I want black people? Like, whoa, all right, racist. Um, But that's just what it, that's what's going on. It's like every, every storyline doesn't have to, every game doesn't have to check off boxes and this, that, and that. And I, while I do agree with that, some games have to. You can't have no life simulator game and it's not simulating life for if not everybody, but for most people. Um, character running around role playing. Yeah, like we should have the the option, the freedom of choice. Sometimes every game is not going to call for that. But the ones that do just do it right. That's it. Disabilities and sin baked into the game itself, not just a mod. I think that's one of the only things I've never really seen them tap into yet. The most I saw was like, and I don't know if that, I, I don't know if this is organic, if I'm misspeaking, but I've seen, uh, I'm seeing hearing aids in my game, but I don't know if that's a mod. That might be a mod. Um, That might be a deep indigo. Cause I've been seeing my Sims walking around with hearing aids. Tommy redeemed stretch. Why are you trying to hear my bones snap, crackle, and pop? Hearing aids are base game. Okay, so that's a start, but they can do better. You know, I'm always gonna say they can do better. Um, <clears throat> games of con decades of content centering certain people, but they're mad because other people want to. Yes, it's that's literally what is happening right now in gaming, where like it's decades of, and then they're trying to act like. We're saying in order to have a good game, it has to be diverse. And it's like, no, but 
that's part of it though because there are some great games we played over the years that weren't diverse at all it's not but it's just like if you plan on doing this do it correctly and like you said everything can't center the same few groups of people as if so many people from all over the world don't partake in this hobby forgot they added the hearing aids so yeah a bunch of incels are like on a weird rampage on the internet harassing games journalists and like gamers because people want to see themselves in games or at least if they're not wanting to see themselves they want their stories to be told correctly if you are going to tell a story about a demographic that you are not a part of make sure you're telling the story correctly that's it that's all um but you know like i said all right the, the gaming space is full of a lot of like horny dudes that don't go outside and the most coochie they see is in video games like they was touting this porn simulator up and down the timeline i'm like you could literally just watch porn for that i don't understand you know what i'm saying and then booty games do exist i'll be calling them booty games adult games do exist there's so many adult games you could support rather than just doing this i want to hear them pop and lock well you're not going to hear too much popping and locking because i just cracked my back like five minutes ago shout out to all the booty games yeah heaven wherever heaven is he know all about the booty games Evan love him a booty game. Nello said brown rice and a pork chop, sorrel juice. Love you, girly. Hey, how you doing? Nice to have a pack representing disabilities. I agree. I definitely agree. I'm trying to go pro, not pro. Use a sick pup, but yeah, heaven and his booty games. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a there's a community for that that exists. But yeah, big argument because people only want to say see the same two or three demos in a game. And it's like, no, gaming has changed. Gaming has evolved. And a lot of people are not standing for it. And the worst part about it is seeing people who run indie studios get harassed for making their games. When the conversation of diversity first came up years ago, it was make your own games. And now so many, 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 many people have begun to do so. And there's, and that same group of people is still complaining. Like you don't want no, you don't want people to make their own games. You just don't want these things to exist because they don't center you and what you deem attractive and acceptable. Um, that's really just what it is. Cause there are so many smaller studios, indie studios that have popped up and made some amazing things in the past decade, the past 15 years, great stuff, great games, great content. And despite the pitfalls and the BS of the industry, they still push through and create what games they create the content that they want to see their beat. They, every day people are becoming the change that they want to see and these people still have so much to say about it. And it's like, no, you just don't want these things to exist. And you need to just say that. Add more disabilities and disorders. I don't think so. I don't think that that's crazy. That's actually something that people have been asking for for a long time. Okay, so medical wearables. So like right here, the hearing aids and stuff like that. Started playing Sims again. First thing I did was look for your CC. OMG, I found you. Hi, how you been? How are you, Sunny Nights? Show you games, friends. Bounce, bounce, girls three in the friends list. That definitely sounds like a booty game to me. That sounds like something I'll catch heaven on. Mobility aids. I want to see some canes and wheelchairs. Tommy, yeah, Tommy is sick pup. He be on them booty games. Prosthetic arms and legs. I just think it would be fire adding disability to the game so hopefully it happened even offered to consult with the team i can't speak for the team because that's not something that i've you know talked to them about but i wonder if it's like a fear of how it would be perceived and received by the public because for those that have played sims since the beginning 
and I mean from Sims 1, Sims 2, Sims 3, y'all can all attest to the fact that Sims has gotten much softer in its gameplay and in its marketing and in its it's nowhere near as dark as it used to be. It's nowhere near as difficult as it used to be. There's nowhere near as much conflict as there used to be. So I don't know if it's like a an attempt to avoid certain things and like I don't I don't know what that is. Like leaning into the leaned into the quote unquote cozy. Yeah, that's why I'm like, were they trying to escape? you know, certain things, but people want, you know, they want their reality. Trunk to appeal to more people, abuse from every angle, from unhappy gamers, trying to find your CC, I can't find them. Well, what CC I have left is on my website. Um, I don't have a lot of CC cause I don't make a lot of, I don't really make CC anymore. I kind of just, um, I, I made some stuff a few years ago and that's it because I couldn't keep up with like the constant updated. So if you have any like traits for me, unless you know how to uh, update them yourself, get rid of them, please. Because I'm talking about as, as recent as like two weeks ago, I'm going in the, uh, debtor pool discord and I'm still seeing people w trying to hold on to the fuck boy traits. And I'm like, no. And the petty traits from like three, four years ago, please delete all of that. Unless you or somebody know how to update it, get rid of it. Cause I'm not updating it. I'm not, um, I don't know how to organically update mods. I don't know XML, nor do I know Python. So I'm not going to be chasing behind. Um, cause they, they have a, a program. Zerbu has a program where it allows you to like create and update the mods, but like, I'm not going to be chasing behind Zerbu waiting to see when they update, whenever they dip and using that to depend on updating my mods. And like, like I said, the constant back and forth, I can't do it. The game updates like once a month and that's a lot of stress and responsibility for something that I didn't, I'm not monetizing, nor am I trying to monetize. I'm like, nah, What's my website? Xmiramira.com. It's more, I think things up there just like art and like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't download no mod. That's not a piece of art or a piece of makeup or something. Not cash doll. I'm crying. I'm not making her. I made her already. This is an old Sim. Um, I'm just trying to find a new look for her. I can dig it. Abuse from every angle. See what's going on on YouTube. Shout out to the YouTubes. Go back to controlling what we consume. Lean to cater to younger demographic. Yeah, because the community is like overrun with children. And it's a lot of kids that play Sims. And that was, I guess, what they was trying to appeal to. But like, still got a lot of adult. You have a reasonably sized adult player base that's been playing this game since they themselves were kids and we got attracted to a totally different game um i think this will work but just oh this actually yo this hair is perfect for um my sim self's whole tetris era Yo, yes, my newbie and queen. Oh, I found it. I found it. 30 plus the main ones playing Sims. Python is the choice. Hate it out here. Her what? My whole Tetris era. Y'all want me to type in whole Tetris? I'm going to type it in. Hold on. Whole Tetris. It's just pretty much is a whole tap, but that's a girl. That's it. Ankh Annie, right? Yes, my whole Tetris era, self Sims whole Tetris era. My beautiful black Nubian queen. Are you planning on trying Paralives? I am. I was watching the preview video or some of the gameplay videos for. Ooh, okay, Chrome Angel, I see you. You got the tatas till Tuesday. 
Hey, this work. Are you planning on trying paralyzed? Have y'all seen the paralyzed thing for um the paralyzed gameplay video from a while back? I'm picking up what you putting down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm trying to enter the beautiful black Nubian queen era. I feel like the, the crystal pack has me in spot. How are you just gonna take her whole outfit? That's that's wild. Danny's hair eats. It absolutely does. Why is some of these shoes? Okay, so it's this dress. Somebody, I guess this dress collides with some of the shoes. Ooh, we get her some crystals on the wrist. Yeah. Makeup browns. I'm trying to find maybe. Okay, that works. And then Necro Dog released some default feet, which I need to go get. And Devil Stompers. You you just gotta fascinated by the amount of CC that you have. I'm I'm devastated at this point. I'm like, it's time for a clean, like a big cleanup. But like I'm trying to do it in a way that like I don't destroy my save because when you delete too much stuff and the time it takes to put everything all back together, you could destroy your save. Like not destroy in the sense of like it's broken, but like destroy in the sense of like you spending so much time putting it back together, you don't get to play. Nello, what mod has your cast like this? So when you say cast like this, what do we mean? The background, the columns, the five column mod, ball head sense walking around every... So because I guess I got so much CC, instead of being bald, they walk around with that afro. So it's this afro she got on. It's, and I'm, I'm not finna stay up here and do all her outfits, but it was an afro. Why she got the cowgirl fit? She had brown hair. Her hair is all over the place. She got wigs. I'm finna copy and paste this hairstyle. Um, It's something I don't like here. Maybe I need to lower the opacity of her skin. Max, are you back there sneezing? Are you back there I chewing? I'm so sad because one of these creators that makes really, really nice, realistic uh skins just left the community. They just dipped. Hold on. I think I like this one. It was like, it's been nice. Thanks for everything. And, and dip. Yeah, he's sneezing again. What you over there sneezing about? You got allergies? Matter of fact, is that even him? Was that, which one of y'all was sneezing? Y'all cuddling? Y'all getting intimate? All right, I'm gonna leave y'all alone. They in the corner getting intimate. I made them a little corner with a blanket by the heater. And they just lay up in that corner with each other all damn day. And they fight and then they sleep and they cuddle. And then she skibbity pap his ass. You know that skibbity pap where the, where the cats will smack the hell out you? She do that all, all upside his head. And then they go to sleep. You talking to cats or dogs? Two cats. Cats cuddling. That's cute. Yeah, they sleep with each other. They cuddle. Um, I'll never forget. I always tell the story of when I first got them because I adopted one and then one was given to me the next day or like two days later. And it was a fight because they both had to get used to the environment while also getting used to each other at the same time. So they used to fight until one day I overslept and... I woke up with two of them sleep next to me on the other side of the bed, looking like yin and yang. So when I get up, I see that they had ripped open the bag of cat food all over the kitchen and look like they ate it and fell asleep next to me. So I'm like, so I overslept. They said to hell with you. We going to get this food. 
and it looked like it was a team effort the way they I, i'm not even joking they literally was laying in the bed next to me like the yin and yang symbol and they just was sleep i'm like hello becky thank you for that resub can we get some cheeks in the chat and I never forgot that because up until that point, they was fighting. He couldn't come nowhere near her. She smacking him all in his face. She beating the hell out of him all the time. He, he, he wanted to cuddle with her. He wanted to play with her. He was excited. And she was just like, get the hell out of my face. That's part of why I kind of named her Xena, like after Xena Warrior Princess, because she used to be beating the hell, well, not even used to. She still be beating the hell out of him. I only intervene when I hear hissing. And um, they laid up in that bed like yin and yang. And I was like, not y'all working together to do bullshit. Not a bonding session. Zena said, for food, we can work together. Pretty much. Realized I trust him. He stole food with me. Yeah, they they robbed the, they they broke into the, I don't even want to say, yeah, they robbed the cat food out the kitchen. They was like, mm, this, this half asleep too much. It is very much a love hate relationship. Very, very much a love hate. They fight, they cuddle, they fight, they cuddle, they fight, they cuddle. And I just be sitting there looking at them in awe, like y'all steady beefing. Mira, I missed you, OMG. How have you been? Not a bonding session. Let's go teamwork, not Seth laughing. Listen. Listen. Now, have you ever been swallowed up? Oh, wait. Oh, no way. Okay. Being an adult struggling. Oh, yeah. Join the club. I've been going through changes time changes daylight savings time bills everything i feel like everything is just beating everybody or almost everybody ass right now you know so just know that you are not alone in that i feel like this is like editorial makeup or something okay um i'm not still supposed to be doing makeup let me move on to make uh to to jewelry Okay, it fits that neck correctly. Piercings. Let me give her some Nubian queen. Hold on. I got to find you some Nubian queen earrings. My beautiful black sister. Inflation and IRS kicking my tiny booty cheeks right now. Honestly, same. Yeah. Now she about to fly away. Oh, child. Daylight savings is kicking. Yo, when the time changed one way, it was tearing me up. And then the time changed back, it's still tearing me up. I had me a nice little flow going, a nice little time workflow going thing going on. And the time just, it yeeted me into orbit. Like when I say orbit, you know that gift of Winnie the Pooh going off into orbit? Like it yeeted me out like that. Like it was bad. Um... So I can hear everything. Adult life, right? That part, right? Like it's it's just been tearing me up. But I I hope everybody's okay and like persevering and pushing through because it shit ain't shit ain't sweet. Shit ain't sweet out here. Inflation is tearing people up. No wonder I've been feeling so sleepy. Daylight savings. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to leave your neck bare, my Nubian queen, because we're going to be making jewelry. 26 and slapping me left and right. 30 done went upside my head. So felt. Now let me see them Beyonce earrings. We existing. Listen. Like it. Characters look hella cartoony. You talking about I'm paralyzed? Wait, we didn't put nails on her. 
31 has been terrible. Oh, no. My hair looks so fine. Thank you. I ain't been this bad since 22. I done forgot how to subscribe with Prime. Yo, if Odyssey is here, can Adi help with that? Because apparently Adi made me aware that they buried the Prime subscription someplace. So it's still there. It's just harder to find. Adi was like struggling to find the, um, struggling to find the, the prime button. It's like deep in the settings for some reason. I don't know what's going on. Oh, shoot. Of course they did always have to do it through browser haters. I was struggling for years. It's worse now since talking in the loading screen. What? That's new. That's your sense talking about Seneca Naranga. Amazon be playing. Looks so pretty. Do you have an African dress? I probably do somewhere in here. I should. I know I have like African head wraps and things like that, but dresses. Hmm. Good question. I don't know. Damn, she look like she going to a party now. You're my African queen, girl of my dream. Where is that from again? Oh, I like the way that that looked. Hey, when the older generation keep comparing their time to ours. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, I have gotten into quite a bit of arguments with my parents because they were adults in an era where you were taught that you work this job for 30 years and you're able to get a house and you're able to take care of a family off of the salary of one person's work. Nowadays, it's like the salary of two people can't even properly get a house and take care of one child, let alone two, three, four or five, however many babies they was popping out back in the 50s back when pensions technically existed, right? Like this is the, this is our reality now. And it's much different. African queen by two phase. Shit, I'm gonna have to go listen. Four or five times the national minimum wage. Parents out of touch of reality. Yeah, I think after just like a certain age group, it's like they, it's like, what? Y'all are lazy. We had to do this, this and this. And it's like, you do realize that y'all achieved four times what we do with a fraction of the work that we do or put in on a daily basis, right? Or the fraction of the accolades. People are walking around collecting degrees like Pokemon cards and still struggling to find proper employment. Like people literally like, all right, I'm gonna go get, I'm gonna go get my PhD in this. I'm gonna get my master's in this. Like people are out here collecting degrees like Pokemon cards and still have problems getting jobs when they get out of college. It's just really, it's really sucky right now. Master's degrees and still work in entry level positions. Yeah, no, that's hurtful. Cause that now masters ain't nothing to play with. Still can't even get a job interview. Yeah. And it's like doing all of this work, all of this time in college, all of this money spent, all of this energy spent just to enter a workforce that's so heavily motivated by greed and nepotism is like, it's a, it's an eye opener. And it's really, it's really sad. There's a lot of these jobs that like people can't get is because they're too busy hiring people that they know already. And, or they're in the process of trying to replace people with AI robots technology they're trying to replace people and then they hiring people that they already know whether the person be, is qualified or not they pushing their friends in these positions nepotism no joking is definitely not limited to the arts oh it's not going to debt for college because that's what you're told you're supposed to do yeah because somewhere along the lines you're supposed to be able to make enough money to pay it back the problem is a lot of people don't get 
don't get there. And if they do, it takes them decades to get there. And with interest, you end up paying a lot more money than you plan to or than you anticipated. And so not about who you know, not what you know. Yeah, it's a hurtful reality, but that's really what it is. Like, and it doesn't matter the job, the industry, the whatever, knowing and being knowledgeable helps, but sometimes it's just who you know and just having to learn how to adapt and adjust as you go. You know, the, um, you will be astonished at the amount of people who get some of these jobs who aren't qualified on paper, but because they knew someone or they appealed to someone, they got that job. Who you know makes it 100% easier job because the connection is rough out here. More opportunities. Yep. It sucks. If I knew people in the film industry, you better believe I'm on my, I'd be on my Sam Levinson. Got with a company that want to hire me and train me. That's another thing. Finding a company that you can grow with too. That's something I, I'm cool with. You find a company. Yeah, I may not know everything about this thing, but I'm willing to learn. And I think to me, that's important than a lot. That's more important than a lot of stuff. I'm willing to learn and I'm willing to try to figure it out and adapt. I think that's very important to i think that's a very important quality to have should we do okay i'm i'm gonna do purple this is gonna be her hair for everything and then yana we're gonna um want to get into the tech field but child i don't know Cybersecurity is looking a bit more appealing to me Either that or community management. Underqualified doing whatever, more opportunities. I wanna get into, I met so many people who suck at their job and I'm just like, how'd you get it? Yeah, that's usually probably a who you know. Or sometimes people just have really great personalities, you know, and they appeal to whoever made the decision. I see if my job was hiring to get my friend put on hiring and my job is slim to none now, keeping at high turnover so they can keep employees at lower salaries. Flip a brick. Damn, not you flipping bricks. I, you know, at first when you said flip a brick, I thought you meant like flip the table out of anger. And then I realized, oh, that's not what he mean. He means something else. But you're pretty, thanks. salaries yeah it's so much foul stuff that you won't know until you know like if y'all saw the the quiet on set documentary about nickelodeon when i was watching it and i i didn't know that like companies were splitting employee salaries so they were paying unqualified men don't call unqualified younger men full salaries while splitting the women, they're splitting their salary and, and, and taking that money that would go to one person and paying the both of them. And I never, never, never knew. I, I never knew that that was something that people was doing. Um, Storm creation one day. One day, speaking of that, have y'all watched X-Men? Because I'm really digging this new X-Men it actually made me go back and watch and like I'm now rewatching X-Men like the original um X-Men cartoon. Hey yo. I haven't I've been watching the old series. You should go check it out. The new one is nice. Somebody will have to get clapped. Yeah. So one of the so that's another one of the things that they were saying that Dan Schneider had did where like he it was a lot of sexism in the workplace and it reflected on how they were being treated in the day to day from the beginning when they was trying to say like, Oh, you don't know of any funny women writers. There are no funny women writers. Like they was just being sexist and weird out the gate. But then he split their salary and had both of them getting paid 
one person's salary, but like splitting it down the middle got threatened when they asked about it to the, I guess the writer's guild. I don't remember what it's called. He threatened a lady and then he, um, I guess just, it's just really messed up. And then he had them working for, I think where she, the, they signed on for another season of the show and he wanted her to work for 11 weeks for free while paying the men in full for the whole time. And men keep in mind men that were not as experienced as them and were new to the industry younger. And they were starting them off with much better pay, much better salaries out the gate. So a lot of sexism going on. Do that with X-Men Evolution 2, 11 weeks. Yeah, I tried to get, tried to convince them. I think she says she only lasted two days before she quit. She couldn't deal with the, the workplace BS. But I, up until I watched that documentary, I never knew that that was something that companies did. Like, I didn't know they was like, splitting up salaries and taking a salary of one person and paying multiple people with it. That's crazy. Sims challenge, urban Barbie legacy. She has it all posted. I'm already doing the Barbie legacy. I'm going to look and see what, um, I'm definitely going to check it out though. Cause just cause I'm already doing a Barbie legacy. Don't mean I can't switch that shit, switch shit up. <laughs> Your loading screen, I love it. Thanks. Made it difficult for her to make a living and left. That's why they don't want you talking about. And that's why it was so frowned upon for so long. Cause like you really could be working along somebody that makes tens of thousands of dollars more than you. Like, and it, it exists in every field from like, I don't care if you are working stock at Walmart or if you are a streamer or a content creator, like you could be literally working on projects with other creators and you could be getting paid. They could have paid you $300 and there's a creator next to you. That's probably getting 15,000, 30,000, 20,000, whatever. And that's not even always to say they got better numbers than you or whatever. They either just ask for more or somebody put them on that they can advocate for more. And it's just a lot of, a lot of nonsense. And that also happens in corporate settings. So they try to punish people for it. But right now the house is resting. Um, they spent, as you can see, like their spellcaster charge is bananas. Jamie snuck out to go be with her boyfriend. So, you know what I'm saying? They supposed to be going to the beach, a beach bonfire. Um, Yana is getting up. We're going to have her, you know, wash her parts, use the bathroom, probably go get her some roti. If it's still some roti downstairs, or was it pancake? Is the pancake still sitting here? Yeah. The pancakes is still sitting here. She could eat these pancakes. Um, Mizuki, I think that's her name, Mizuki. Yeah, we're gonna have Mizuki. She be repairing stuff and doing all of the cooking in the house. Yeah, you go ahead and repair that toilet bowl and then you can go back to sleep because we need you nice and refreshed for when you get sucked up later. Salaries. Talk about your salaries. You need to be placed under a prison. That was bogus stuff. What? Yeah. All right. Browse books. She browsing. I think we done browsed into a damn error. Either way, I'm going to show y'all what I've been working on with this house. I'm still kind of on the fence with this house because as much as I like it, I don't quite know if I like it for them. I don't know if I, if I like this house for them just yet. Um, browse books. Well, girl, unbrowse. Can we experiment brew vampire potion? Oh, now we can access vampire potions. Okay, good. So she's now a vampire spellcaster. 
so she can do her own sets of spells and her own i want to show y'all some of the spells we can do um when the sims get some rest and we come back and show y'all some how some of these mods operate clean house girl go to bed did he get some rest who he finna suck on because that girl sleep vlad finna get up and start sucking on the neighbors who outside who outside who is outside why is nobody ever around here that's another reason why i'm just like should i move them to windenburg because this neighborhood be kind of dead like why is the neighbors not i know it's 12 o'clock but like sims be outside don't none of these sims be out and about we trying to find somebody to suck on he needs some dinner we can't find no dinner in these streets wait i think we found some dinner hold on who this oh she's another vampire we can't we can't suck on her she a vampire onions okay not the onion plant she's experimenting yavana we're gonna send yavana out here to come dig and see what crystals and stuff she could find they need sims to suck the only sims we ever see around here is other vampires which i find that quite hilarious wild snapdragon flower uproot plant harvest snapdragons yeah she's either a spell caster hold on can it'll tell me if he could suck on her let me see something it'll tell me in what capacity he can interact with her you got to be careful though because I, I at a point i had a mod where you could um you could if a sim that was a vampire drink from a werewolf they would die blaze she's right there ask permission to drink from neck ask for permission to drink compel for a deep drink irresistible slumber cannot turn another vampire so she is a vampire and we can ask for permission but that doesn't guarantee we're gonna get permission and she hates him actually so yeah i don't know he over here trying to be on his justin timberlake singing and pweep, 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 doo -doo -doo -dee -dee. Doo -doo -doo -dee -dee. look at him biscuit head ass always um singing and playing the guitar now have you ever been swallowed up have you ever been swallowed have you ever been swallowed up wait what's she doing messing with that but yeah i'm still on the fence about if i like this house for them i love this house i just don't know if it's the best house for my spellcaster gameplay um not you laughing wait because he said it it is just naturally like have you ever been swallowed up like why would he set himself up like that with that sermon why would you do that why would you say that you you already know how people be cutting up why would you he knew what he was talking about somebody have you ever been swallowed up so you gonna walk through this you're not even gonna walk around you're gonna walk through the damn grass to the um to the to the to the rocks a time of swallowing where everything is so overwhelming y'all please please but yeah i kind of feel some type of way um about this area i don't know if it's just because it's this area but it'd be kind of dry like i thought it was gonna be like more immersive over here but it'd be kind of dry and it don't be no sims out here it's always dead it'd be some people during the daytime maybe i gotta move them to the city i don't know but like we definitely need more people to suck on and more people for him to rob like we need some more robbery and fraud we definitely need more robbery and fraud that long ass robe who long ass robe appeal to the swallowed urban vampires and witches kills me the most is the way his ass is drifting floating if you will around the pulpit 
Y'all gonna make me go back and watch that damn video. Ocean or I thought it's just that or ocean point. So to see if um her rent was working, I went back and put like a bunch of rental properties down all over um San Sequoia. San Sequoia is now um you know how like IRL, there's some cities that's just full of new apartment buildings and it's just like full of new real estate. That is what San Sequoia is right now. I think there's only like two actual regular residential lots still left in San Sequoia. And the vast majority of it is just rental property. Urban vampires and witches. I'm cooking and all I can hear, all I keep hearing is, have you ever been swallowed? And he needs somebody to suck on. And see now. No, that, well, that is kind of my fault because I was saying like, you know, um, I'm just as a vamp. He's just a vampire hunting for blood. He's a vampire hunting for blood, but ain't no blood to hunt. The neighborhood dry as hell. We finna move these Sims out and probably just leave this house behind for a more honest, wholesome family that's going to utilize the resources. I just wish so much of this wasn't decoration. A lot of this is like decor. Who house is this? I don't remember who house that was. I know self Sim and Sean lived right here. Yup, that's that that big old red couch. They they lived here and they was they was having their intimate life here. Sunny nights, thank you for that sub. Can we get some cheeks all in the chat? Self Sim and, and her little well, it's her boo thing. Where the hell is the front door? How y'all niggas get outside? This is this is what I be talking about. I be I be popping up. And I'll be looking around and they don't got no doors. Had to sub after that. After what? Wait, wait, what I missed? They ain't got no doors, man. Now, how y'all get out the crib? Hold on, I need to see this. Cause like, how y'all get outside? Is it the bike? No, that's locked off too. Oh, y'all are trapped. Whoever lives there is actually trapped. Let me see. No doors, they ain't got no doors. They ain't got no doors. These hoes don't got no furniture. Whole bunch of new, freshly moved in people. And then you got this house that still don't have no furniture yet. And still we are accumulating furniture and adjusting. I don't know, I don't know. I just think the space is probably also a little bit too big for me right now. What's this? Encyclopedia Vampiric of Volume 1. So yeah, she's now a vampire spellcaster and she's currently learning blood magic. That mod is from Zero. That mod allows vampires to have spellcasting abilities and their own set of spells. And with these set of spells, they can go on to do magic. The only kicker is that when they do the magic, it consumes their, um, their vampire energy because they're using blood to do the magic. And yeah, if you are too heavy handed with your Sims and the spell casting, you are going to be out of vampire energy all the time. Like you're going to look up and constantly be out of vampire energy if you are too heavy handed with it. So what I did, cause I, I was playing this morning and what I did this morning was I had them just build up their skills. Everybody grinded up their skills. Cause we're trying to get everybody back to where they were before I took out all of these different mods for, um, spellcasting and everybody for the most part is back to at least master rank in magic. Everybody's back to master rank. So Yana's back to master rank. Jamie's back to master rank. Yvonne is back to master rank. Like 
most of them are back to master rank in um spell casting but the amount of books that we had to st yo actually i actually robbed the magic realm we went to the magic realm and we bought a bunch of books and we stole a bunch of books like they was just out here just stealing just teething teething the books it was out here stealing oh god my back oh god wait sorry y'all oh shit wait ah i cracked my back a little too hard this gonna be a meme when your favorite streamer get mad oh oh neighborhood dry as hell it's so dry it's nobody outside it's nothing going on none of these sickers is about it we caught somebody outside yesterday and he tried to pickpocket her he's trying he should have drank her blood and left her in the bushes See, every time you say magic all i can think about is three is the magic number from schoolhouse rock schoolhouse rock why'd you have to take it back that far to schoolhouse rock oh my back pain just intensified schoolhouse rock lord have mercy jesus christ of latter-day saints but um yeah stretch it out girl i listen i stretched i stretched my back and that sucker said i stretched my back and that sucker said um it cracked in like four places and i'm actually scared what in the hell is happening Not drug dealing. Why am I getting drug dealing errors? Ain't nobody selling drugs. You better go ahead and drink that girl. Ask that girl for a sip of her. What? Oh, oh no, she got the nerve to get mad because you trying to get a sip of her. Well then, you don't. This why you just compel her for a deep drink. You not asking. You telling girl, I'ma sip you. Oh, he ain't sipping you. Not your. Not you ain't strong enough to drink the girl. That's wild. Now they dis despise each other. Don't try to run. Mira frightened. So you got enough to put her ass out. But you ain't got enough to drink from her. You might have to just tap into the supply in the house. Listen, um, Vlad Timberlake, go in the damn house with your with your bunny rabbit shoes. Oh my god, let me see how he sound. Uh-uh. Said this calls for a song. What? Dude. Oh my god. So you you just had to sing about it. She over there in the slumber. Okay, we can't drink her because that show that show sister-in-law that just breezed past. Let's let's stop the speed real quick. Why is Malaya uh speed running? Girl. Yo, she be gone. All right, we need to Neighborhood reconnaissance. What? What is that interaction? Moon gaze. Put him on the feet with a cowboy card or I said something great in the works. Whose man's is this? This is her man. Wait, girl, why your cootie out? Are you still in dark form? I think we going back and create a sound. Because I do want to fix her dark form. The game does this thing where it automatically links the dark form and the regular form. And what happens is the Sims, um, the Sims look the same across both forms. And I don't like that. I want to at least change like her eyes to be white and put the blood back on her mouth. Like I want her to really look like somewhat threatening when she goes into her dark form. 
I'm thinking about leaving him and his bunny slippers in his dark form, though. His bunny slippers give personality, if you will. It gives him a dash of personality and it makes him stand out amongst the rest. <laughs> yes, Sir Pava, Zabaro Watsonini. All right, we not we not taking off your bunny slippers, not yet. He he give me Count Dracula vibes. Ah 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 ah. We gotta find y'all a new neighborhood to live in though, cause this is is drier than geriatric. Uh, wait, no, I ain't gonna say that. I'd be like, what? What did you say? Okay, let's unlink with her dark form and let's switch to her dark form and see what is going on here and why, why it's giving base game baby bag bit. Let's see what's happening here. All right. Turn off reshade so I can see what I'm doing. You need some pants. I don't think anybody's going to be scared of you with no pants on. They may be scaroused at best, but it's not giving what it has supposed to give. If you sitting up here, you know, looking enticing and whatnot, but you got to, you got to scare the townsfolk. Where the blood on the lip? Give me the bloody lip. We got to find that bloody lip. You're going to pull up on somebody talking about rawr, and they be like, you're out to you too. Like there's no fear there. Okay. There we go. Cause remember you ain't no baby back bitch. You got this. Put some marks in her face. I'm gonna put on some count Dracula ass dress. Oh, this work. Oh, Gal Nairobi. All right. I'm definitely going to have that Nambarani Zimze on their ass. Okay. Um, not the middle age pack. I remember when this pack came out and I see people in discord like middle age for who? And I was like, damn. Wait, I had some really good skin details from Moonlight. Where are my Moonlight skin details for my vampire? Okay. There we go. Can I make it more red? Yeah, I can't alter that. We got to make you look scary. Tired of these cigars being scaroused. Vampire mouth. What's your teeth look like? Do you actually have your vampire teeth going on in there? Or is it like a, it's like a base game set of teeth? It's like darker, but like, it's kind of ashy, but you know what? I guess I can give the ashiness a pass. Vampires do be kind of ashy. They they be a little bit. See now, where you going with the? You could get some piranha teeth or something. That's the Maxis match chompers. Some alpha chompers. That's that piranha teeth. What would you do if you um? went on a date and they, and they teeth was like this. They're like this. And they was, they was like, yeah, you look succulent. Oh, hold on. I think I found it. There we go. There we go. Okay. So we got that. Um, and I know that 
it is dark form and i don't know why this was her dark form workout she probably had on some leggings and that's cool and all but i think i'm just gonna put on that little 1800s dress the little 1800s vampire slayer dress and have it so that all of the outfits for dark form look like this so fucking cool thanks fighting for my life make it try to make it obvious not obvious that i'm looking listen listen she's like the queen bee vampire she's like the um most powerful vampire in the save so or at least she was i gotta put her skills and stuff back athletic child athletic these piranha teeth will he still like me damn it was this dress that i was so sad about because what the hell i gotta get rid of this dress but i had another dress there's at least two other dresses i have in the same vein what is this but why can I always find them when I don't need, I was about to say, why can I always find them when I don't need them? Piranha teeth is chaos. Like, how would you feel? Would you still love me if I had piranha teeth? Would you still be intimate with me? If I look like I can eat you. Um, that's definitely giving, babe, would you love me if I was a worm? The amount of time you spend in cast, I get so impatient. I hate even being in cast. Yo, it's like, I don't know. How do I put this? I kind of hate being in cast too. But I, I like like for my sims to look good and then also i'm i'm very impatient as well so like um when you see me taking my time and like going through it and i'm actively fighting against my instinct and my instinct is always go get get the hell out of cast go play the game like i like to play the game more than anything and then cast and build mode comes second to that but I've learned to just spend the time and cast and do what I need to do sometimes as I go, or sometimes I just sit down and do it all in one swoop because every time the Sims has an outfit change or the outfits change, and then I get irritated all over again because I got to look at somebody, somebody got on, like she's sitting up there on a treadmill with panties on and a prayer, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you try to not do it and then you regret it later get some holy water this victorian look works i still don't mess with the undead though yeah she's definitely giving god save the queen let me stop before i get ate up but get some holy water blizzard why you getting holy water damn why the middle part so light or the side part so damn light i don't know what hair color hmm Shiben. I need like a Queen Bee-esque hairdo. 
I be finding them all the time. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not messing with the Maxis Match colors right now. Okay. Mm. I don't really look like herself, though. Yeah, she looks like she got a lot on her mind. I'm telling you, these wig placements. And your sims running around looking like Hetty Murphy. Like she got a lot on the brain. I saw you standing in the rain. Let's see. We are cycling through, cycling through, cycling through. Hetty Murphy. Yes, Hetty Murphy. That's when someone looks like they got a lot on their mind. And ain't nothing wrong with having a lot on your mind. Because I, too, have a bright future ahead of me. Let me see. Not party all the time. Party all the time. Party all the time. I might just completely white out her eyes. Ooh, I'm scared. I'ma tell Jelani you punned. Wait, where I punned at? Cause I said I'm ahead of my time. What happened? Matter of fact, where the hell Jelani been? I need to check on him. I haven't seen a pun in a, in a good little minute. That's our lead pun pal in the spot. Mm-hmm. That is our lead pun pal. Party all the time. You want to party all the time. Party all the time. She looks badass. Thank you. I'm trying to make her look as scary as I can. So I could be like, ooh, this some scurry shit. So that when she actually hits her dark form, it makes sense. And she not sitting up there with her little cootie out with them base game ass Walmart panties. I ain't gonna lie, I, I used to be jamming to that song too. Why would you sing it? Cause now it's gonna be stuck in my head. I'm gonna be up in here later on like, my girl wants to party all the time. Party all the time. <laughs> oh my God. Wally World panties. Right, like how are you supposed to be? How are you supposed to be scary and you gonna pull up in your panties, in your damn panties? Ooh, this. Okay, so I think now, um, maybe some nails. The locks, yeah, I think it's a nice touch. No, I gave that stuff with the Sims ball with the orange bikini. Oh, you took out too much stuff. Now they just buck, bucket naked and they got their little base game buns flailing around the save and you sitting there looking like Larry because you're trying to figure out how the hell did you get here. It's a, it's a stressful yet aggravating time. Now it's stuck in my head. What? The in your damn panties. Uh, 
when it updates they disable everything just remember to not save until you turn your mods back on say that issue all the time no one knows what i'm talking about are you talking about the in your damn panties that my girl wants to party all the time party all the time party all the time Ooh, okay um yeah i'm gonna probably do this dress instead because of the necklace that necklace is important that she keeps that on i'm going to also keep her no nah, i'm gonna just put some regular earrings on her but that is her spellcaster charge necklace and vampire so she should hopefully be getting the effects from both um well probably not because the fact that she's both is not recognized by the game it's recognized by a mod let's see okay all right these these this jewelry is a little too elegant you're supposed to be clapping them. Yeah, I'm about to say you're supposed to be clapping holes. In your damn panties. She really sat up there and pulled her butt out in front of everybody. Go little flap her flap her her uh her rump parts out in front of all them people. He said, in your damn panties. Cause like, why is you sitting up there with your rump parts all out for the townsfolk? Rump parts just rumping. Like, ma'am, put your cooter nanner away. Those white dresses are gorgeous. Thank you. Let me save because one thing about me, I'm going to be in cast. And I, I hate being in cast and losing my information. Or losing what I did. Now I need to do some copy and paste and hopefully I don't know if this is going to copy over to all of her outfits. I kind of just want this only to copy over to matter of fact, I'm not even going to do it right now. Because MC Command was being weird yesterday. Everything is being weird right now. I need to figure out why. Endurance run. Okay, that was cool. You know, that that's nice. But endure your ass to, to the... Yeah, endure your ass over there. Sir Pava. Go on ahead. We need to start seeing what some of these spells look like. I would say we could experiment with some of them on Peep and Tom, but the problem is that Peep and Tom is already dead, so the effects ain't gonna hit the same. We actually didn't kill Peep and Tom twice in this house. And here's her sister. Angelia has discovered a new potion. Plentiful needs has been put in her inventory. Yeah. We we don't do nothing but kill um Peep and Tom in this house. You want to be sitting there being a little prevert with your with your hand on your situations, looking in the window. We just gonna kill you. That's it. That's how we that's how we do him. So he's a ghost. He runs around the house sometimes. We already started doing the jewel recharge. Uh, Sim is less likely to develop. Okay, Moonstone. So another way I would see this being beneficial for like, say this household is we can put the crystals in here and it'll affect whatever spell casters are in this room. Quibna, Shribna, here we go. Arcane Ascendance. So it says, Ivana can now harness the full potential of her powers becoming an unparalleled force of the supernatural. Yeah, Umu, girl, this conversation is cute, but your coochie stink. You need to, oh, all right. Well, can we do a spell and fix it? Ripario, 
Yes, Rapario girl. Let's go. Yeah, sir, pop your ass upstairs. Go ahead. Go ahead and repair that. Let me see if this works. Rapario girl. These cigars can't stand me. Let's see what's going on. Will we be able to repair the things? In your pain, in your damn pain. In Koya. And we're going to have to do a seance later, too. Okay. Good. Good. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, Senna K. Now wash your butt. Butt cheeks smelling like boiled bologna. Get in the tub. We down here working on this potion. Well, she's not working on a potion. She's just leveling up her skills so she can do the potion things and she can do the get the things done right she's working on it she's working on it that's the church song wait what's the church song let me see what's going on up here you you finished use the bathroom and make sure you brush your teeth so your breath not you're not out here smelling like a, a bag of butt cheeks can he do it? Commune with the departed. Okay, so he can only commune with the departed. She can only commune with the departed. What can she do? Magic, whirlwind. So she can't initiate nothing, but you can, right? Haunted, haunted house residential. Wait a minute. We didn't have to do that. Spiral volatility. Oh, oh. Perform magic ritual with Yavanna. I guess because it's only the two of y'all in here. We doing another ritual and hoping for the best. Seance table is already in use. Okay. Hoshpa. Hoshpa. The last time we brought a spirit about, I'm gonna show y'all what happened the last time we brought a spirit in here. Real quick, y'all finna be dying laughing. What kind of baloney? Not what kind of baloney. Hello? Nubishi. Kapluna. Dabishi. Ah. Naranga. Yes, a boy. Finally, I can watch the stream. What's up? How you doing? Yo, it's six o'clock already. Well, I, I, I that mean I, I got to go soon, but we gonna, we gonna get into the yibs and the and some of these spells and things. How you just gonna leave her mid spell? That's diabolical. You didn't have to leave her like that, doing that ritual alone. The last time they had some shit shaking in here. The lights was flickering and it was it was wild in here. Girl, if you tired, then go to bed. Well, no, you might have to wash that cooter net. The magic ritual was successful. Okay, good. Because the last one, not so much. They're going to create a conjuring rune, conjure a demon. Not what kind of baloney? Thank you for the biddies. Uh-oh, we conjuring a... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Girl. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. She look mad as hell. Now she started a fire. Oh, she ain't shit. Wait. Oh no. How you gonna start the fire and then look confused? What are you excited about? Why is she excited about the fire? Yo, Evangelia is sick. She be excited about these fires. She be mad hype and then she be putting them out. But we conjured a demon. The demon is upset. So the demon is gonna run around starting fires all over the damn house. That's not the last of it. And I'm just like, child, she finna go set the garbage can on fire. 
The roof is on fire. They like, girl, why you still panicking? Matter of fact, he need his breakfast. You right here. Hold on. Tense. What you tense about? Cause you you finna get some breakfast. Drink plasma. Drink uncontrollably. Brain block from burning out. Broken umbrella. I mean, you could quit your job. You don't really need the job. Shouldn't have seen that. You seen some neighbor butthole? Mm -mm. You weren't supposed to see that. It gone ahead. He gonna suck her up in broad daylight. It's another fire. Where is it? Not you cause the fire in the hallway when you come in. Oh, she a piece of shit. Why would you do that? Why would you actually do that? Is she gonna put it out or is she just gonna stare? They is terrible. Why are you stoked about the f and then laughing about it? She's about how <laughs> Sir Papa Zubaro Watanini. Like, girl. Learn more about fears. The computer broke. Can we get a repairio spell? Like, we don't gotta be sitting here manually repairing nothing. Y'all know how to repair. Not whirlwind. Here go Vlad Timberlake. Here he go. damn nerve she gonna start another fight yeah shit piece of shit let's do reperio wow wow just straight up destroying the crib just straight up destroying the crib wow look how excited she is bruh Oh my God. Hi. Route to safety. Books toasted. Vlad Timberlake is wild. Why none of the others helping? Cause they scared of the fire. They scared of the fire. We need a repario spell in here. She need a shower. Her cooter in her stink. Somebody clean the floors. Come on, let's get that Reperio girl. Necro call. Wait, you don't have Reperio? Yes, you do. Delicioso. You stink? Did you pee yourself or you just stinky? Are you stinky? Use pad. Girl, get, get padded in the bed. Go in the bed. Why are you out here sleeping? That's not a good sleep, my whole Tetris queen. Repair the computer, and then we can see we can begin to see some improvements. Go on ahead and grab you some. What the fuck, yo? Damn, she's overcharging. Who did the fuck? She did the fire again. Oh, she lit her ass on fire. Oh wow. Girl, you might want to fight this demon, child. This demon playing with you. You, you, yeah, Kafluna. You better, you better extinguish your stuff. You ain't no bitch. Don't let her play with you like that. Don't let her play with you. Wow. You better, yeah. The hallway's on fire, too. Extinguish yourself first. Somebody's got to get the hallway fire. Like, Oh, I like this this um this layered look with your hair. It's kind of cool. Get that poor girl a break. I like this layered situation going on with your hair. It is definitely giving photo shoot. You know what I'm saying? We gonna turn on that surface blur, and uh, there we go. Yeah, this is this is uh cinematic, if you will. Mm-hmm. It's giving Fano Websna. The crispy crunchy ombre. Right. It's it's rather nice on you. Caution blur. The computer is still messed up. Computer still sound wild. Is anybody gonna ever fix it? 
are y'all just gonna keep routing to safety when there's not a fire anymore like there's no more fires they're not even trying to she finally left oh that damn demon finally left listen 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 linda sir pava here's what we gonna do wait what the fuck yo Yo, yo, oh my God. Yo, oh my God, my crystals, my crystals. They started another fire? Yo. But Galja, Kipluna. What you mean, Ed of Yaba? Somebody better Yaba y'all asses out here and take this fire down. Bruh. Where is he going? route to safety what the f so y'all just gonna let this shit burn what are you doing <laughs> like some damn dummies and what are you doing miss i ain't scared of nothing you gonna let them burn down your whole backyard this is pussy lit behavior what you saying you can't reach the fire you can't do i have to tp you into this it's like I got a T. I can't even TP her into this. Call of fire Wow. So everything is just gonna burn. That's wild. Fire department, cause they all so scared. It's not even a scare. It's a routing issue now, cause she's not scared. Evangelia is excited about this. Actually, she not scared. She hyped text emergency wait for them to respond four thousand dollars as insurance oh my god all right mizuki you could come out here and clean the floors why we can't clean the floor outside if the floor gonna get dirty outside we should be able to clean the floor outside this has left everyone super exhausted because that dumbass demon came in here and just lit the place ablaze. Okay, he's already asleep. We're gonna leave him to stay asleep. Um, you need to wash your cooter nanner. Yes, yes, you are going in the correct direction. I feel like all y'all smell like boiled bologna and bath salt. And you go on and use the bathroom get in the tub wash up sleep up uh you you know you stink but we don't want you passing out all over the place so i'll let you sleep for a few minutes that ain't grass it is but but since it's stained you should be able to clean it like you would the regular floor girl not you passed out tripna what are you doing okay is there anybody that's not getting ready to go to sleep? This house is drained, child. Okay, so you could share the space with Vlad for right now till we get more beds in here. Hey, Miss Bambi Ren, thank you for the raid. How was your stream? What was you playing? What was you doing? Where's your simming? Wait, what's this sound? Were you yibsing? Boiled bologna and bath salt smell like it don't smell good. It don't smell good. Vampiric grimoire of blood magic. Certain spells can only be performed using the power of the power of blood. She's reading that book for real. Who 
is crying and moaning and oh Nabakusi. Is it you? All right, well, unfortunately, you finna be lunch because Sigas is hungry and they need some of that blood to drink. So you finna get drunk uncontrollably and you know, you could cry and you could survive, but snacks is snacks. Who is this? What's up with your little base game face? How are you? Awesome sis, we was definitely simming. What's going on in your sim save? Cause Vaz is a bit chaotic. We've got somewhat of a dry neighborhood right now. There we go, drink her up. Oh, she's so tiny. Look like you drinking out her ear. She's so daggone little. Uh-uh. Did she say blood? Yeah, vampire time. I can't wait to put the bloody neck mod back. Y'all gonna be shook. They next be covered in blood. That the, a drink that strong would have had. You see, like she also has like things in her face from being cattle. She's cattle, but a drink that strong, her whole chest would have been covered in blood, like her neck and chest. I thought she was sucking her titty. Her titty. Yo, girl, you be all right. You be up in time to make dinner. All right, so let's go terrorize some people outside. But this is why I be talking about we be looking for singers to terrorize and it don't be nobody out here. Is that Faye? Hey, Fayla. Fayla out here like her husband said. Who is this? Rashad, Kiala, hopefully. Well, hopefully you don't get clapped too quick because we finna test out some spells on you. Oh, Meteor Strike. Advanced elemental spell deadly empathize whirlwind. Let me see what whirlwind look like. It's time to start busting these spells out on people calling her catalyst crazy. No, she's literally she's literally cattle. Like that's what it's called. Apparently it's like you a slave of a vampire and they call them cattle. Oh, she busts the spell on her. Oh, wow. So it's like a whirlwind. It creates a whirlwind around the sim and it allows them, they, they can't move. Definitely enjoyed your stream. See you next time. All right, take care. Furio, Desperio, Witch Bolt. Let me see, Silencio. Now she's stuck in there. Hold on, let's see, Does she is she gonna go downstairs to I thought you only thought she was finna bust out one spell. And why are you going all the way back here to... What? All right, so here's the spell. Who is this just gonna what? How you just gonna walk up on some... How do you watch somebody do that? And then you walk up on them. Well, it worked because his ass got electrocuted. Damn. So you want to electrocute these figures? He's like, um, sir. She's like, um, why are you over here trying to talk to me? While you see me busting out spells. Bonafide, Witch Bolt, Zip Zap, Morpheate, Silencio, Whirlwind, Desperio, Deliriate. What about Bonify? Yeah, wanna fish. Look, she is stinky and she is upset about some acne. You don't wanna mess with her. Yo, why is he still trying to make conversation? Damn. He turned him his ass into a dust bunny. Damn. Now he a dust bunny? What the dust bunny talking about? Morphe info. Yeah, we know, Sir Pava. Your cheeks smell like Sir Pava. Did he already leave? Well, whatever she did, it worked. Yeah, she turned him into a dust bunny. She was like, how dare you interrupt my spell? And she wilded out on him. 
and she made his ass a dust bunny so now he could feed you dust you feed him dust he give you money all right girl is there a grill back here y'all should be grilling some barbecue ribs making some good food some good eats yeah let's 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 do that let's get a grill I'm saying this, but like hoping I'm sitting here with my fingers crossed, hoping and wishing and praying that it's not a fire again. Cause we barely recovered from the last one. These, these Sims, you know what I'm saying? They, they barely recovered from the last one. Ain't none of that is a bar Watanini. They just tearing each other up in the flames. Tearing each other up in the flames. Okay, so we're going to get the grill. And let's see. Um, let's do that. Mm -mm. appliances that's wild listen this is wild out here okay i think this would actually go pretty well if i just change the color and look how that matches so well with everything else boom drink up buttercup create potion wait what can you make stink drink Grill, barbecue ribs plate, grilled chicken, saute, hot dogs, sausage and peppers. I want to make some Q&BB recipes. I need to go back into Build By and grab the Q&BB cookbook and recipes. But don't be surprised if some point we come back to this house and I put them someplace else like i don't know i just don't feel like the neighborhood fits the vibes maybe i'll move them to glimmerbrook maybe i'll do that where glimmerbrook is literally just an all occult world it was a point where like all my sims lived in um all my sims lived in uh the vampire world so all my occult sims lived in the vampire world so don't be surprised if I do that with uh, these folks. Just throw all my cult sims in that one area and just let chaos ensue. Okay, hold on. Let me see. Because I ever since I got that expanded catalog, I can't play without it. Um, Where is... We got the Kava Bowl. Now I downloaded four witches specifically. And where's the, yeah, there we, where's, there we, there's the damn pressure cooker. Okay, so the pressure cooker is right here. What else am I missing? Um, The cookbook. The Severinka cookbook? Where the hell is it? Severinka, Severinka. Where are you? I'm looking, I'm looking. And is this little bow bulb? Granny's cookbook? Yeah, that's little bow bulb's cookbook. And I love me a nice custom cookbook. I tell you what. Here we go. Couldn't see it. And how do you expand the bar? I have, uh, it's what's it, better build by by twisted Mexi. But even when I don't have better build by twisted Mexi has their own separate, um, expandable catalog mod. So if I don't want the greater mod, sometimes I would just switch and use just that. 
that stud what's up asia that what's up i love 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 that mod like it's so clutch oh girl shut up you need to wash your coochie that's what you need to do tell about so freaking badish badish your ass in a tub Badish with some soap. All right, here's how we gonna do this. Who is gonna hit the Reperio on this computer so this shit will shut up? Reperio, Reperio. Nobody cares if you hungry. Fix the damn computer. Reperio girl, let's go. I've been trying to get you to repair for like the past two sim business days. Hop to it, sis. Let's go. There we go. Now, let's start with you make lasagna soup. Let me test this out. And then you, if you are not, wait, what are you making? Sausage and peppers. Who's crying? Oh, that's, oh, that's Mizuki. Girl, stop crying. Barbecue brisket. Okay, baby back ribs, collard greens, mac and cheese, and coleslaw. Let's do that. But these show ass in the right. But these show ass in the tub. Are you still stinking? Oh, no, not you making food. You, you man in the grill smelling like that. She on the grill smelling like smegma and sadness. Talk about it. The kitchen appliances. It's time to cook. Yo, Mizuki, get your crybaby ass out from out the back and come cook some food. Cold drinks. Let's make some lemonade or something. What you, what we got? Smoothies, princess party juice, pineapple, coconut smoothies. Swimsuit came from. Share the CC. What swimsuit? Mizuki doesn't have an appointment. If I don't remember off the cuff, then I, I don't remember off the cuff. And it's because they don't be having proper thumbnails. Orange with the little nip. I think I know what you're talking about. I still don't remember where I got that from. I know I've had it for a very long time. Like that is probably like 2015 long time. But if them people don't got thumbnails, then ain't much I could do. Um... I, now I think I know what you're talking about. Soju? Oh, yes. Have you ever tried to, like, Google it out, but, like, fully describe uh, Sims? Wait, just one bottle of soju? But, like, Sims 4, what is it? Sims 4, orange swimsuit, orange bikini. It might pop up, but you would have to. I will. The best I could tell you is that it's really old. So, oh girl, hush. Make my Sims drink soju with almost everything. Why are you grilling over here? What? Ain't no way she came all the way out here with this food. Ain't no. So you just made that for the neighborhood. Put put that in your damn inventory. And go in the house. Why is you stinky taking pictures? You snapping photos with the smegma smell. You stink half of you. All right, her mammy over here sleep. Green apple sold you. Well, almost everything. Girl, you be all right. Oh, the despair. You they not even mean to you. They just drink from you every day. You be all right. Prom girl, ain't nobody going to no prom. Prom these. Stanky snaps. Right. Whose cell phone is going? Oh, that's not the cell phone. That's this. The instant pot. I better come get some soju and stop playing. Stop playing with these cigars. Grab a serving. Is she back home yet, Funky? Oh. Funky girl, you moving a bit slow. The whole family could have had the meal by now and you over here messing around. Wait, what you eating, the lasagna soup? 
I need to try. Well, yeah, I need to eat that again, I guess, because Layla made it a while back. I'm glad to see that she's in human form because Monique is y'all. If y'all watched enough of my streams, y'all remember the the um werewolf running around with the raggedy wig that y'all be like, oh, she got on the Tyler Perry wig. That's her. That's her that be bouncing around with that big ass wig and that that um Home Depot jacket. That be her. This is her in human form. Now imagine spending all this time in creative sim, getting the sim to look all cute, and then she just pop out looking diabolical. Quick bath, Home Depot. The Tyler Perry wig and the Home Depot jacket is truly sinful. We gonna get these baby back ribs out. Call to meal. Grab all servings. All right, lasagna soup. That's good. That's working. That's what makes her different. Adds character. I need for these sips to like wash that butt. Can we, can y'all, can you not get in there? Why are you, why are you ducking and dodging the bath? Why are you dipping and dodging the funk? Like, yeah, tip it all, nothing. It's too many bathrooms in here for y'all to be smelling like this. Way too many bathrooms. Let's see. So she's awake now. We're going to have her just design some jewelry, cut a gemstone. She getting her, her skills up there. I will say we already making different types of gemstones. What are you doing? You need to use the bathroom, clean the kitchen, put away, drink some soju. Why everybody act everybody act the scale? I'm about to have the teenagers drinking it too. They just gonna get in trouble. <laughs> Why does she insist on not bathing? Your cooter nanner needs a washing. Are you that depressed? Like, what are we doing? Girl, get out of the toilet crying. Now she talking about garlic. Oh, she thinking about garlic. Oh, you trying to escape? Girl, repair the toilet. You you not escaping, please. What you mean, Simzay? So nobody could get sold you? Hold on. Aga aga. Wait, did I just put it in the refrigerator? Oh my god. Okay, let's do this one at a time. Put this away, clean this up. Let me see. All that fire and all that stuff that just took place when they didn't have to. I was about to say, what is that noise? But that's her cutting the gemstone. Okay, spy asked to get leftovers. Oh, we put it in your inventory? No, no, no. All to meal. Clean up. Oh, somebody got some soju. What's this? 11 servings of mac and cheese? Girl. That look like 11 separate servings of mac and cheese. So you just walking around smelling cheesy. What is wrong with these damn sims? Recently bitten, recently bitten. Why does it hurt? What is it? But need to swipe. She's a klepto. Oh, so she's she's tense because she want to rob them. 
don't be mad peaceful sim around an angry sim there's no reason to fight or be angry there must be a way the sim can stop being so angry she might get in trouble because they over there take partaking in the alcohols she might get yelled at maybe not she probably said i ain't your mammy spotted dirt frog is vlad even awake i hate that like when i click on the thing for hygiene it goes to a sink like you y'all are not going to be in here taking whole baths so explain to me why you keep on with this oh not the spirits are attacking her again she can't even enjoy some soju without the spirits trying to attack her damn can we not drink the soju hold on no, I don't want to sell it. Put it in her inventory. Let me see something. Give drink to. I don't think they could drink the soju. Who soju is it? Oh, wait, no, she's drinking it. She drank the hell out of that soju. Girl. Are you a straight edge? Cause that happens too. Sims, if they have like the straight edge trait, they will not even get the option to drink alcohol or smoke weed in any. Yup, she's a straight edge. Refrain from using alcohol, or other recreational, non-prescribed drugs, cannabis, LSD, cocaine. She can't drink. She refuses to. I'm like the only time I see that is a, is when it's a straight edge sim. Mac and cheese. Yeah, study them tomes. Why would you? Yerbic. Girl, go to bed. She sleeps in the backyard. She be all right. They be, they be eating her up in the backyard. Study magical tome. If you know the spell already, why not read some spells you don't know? Y'all hit the magic, what you call it. Learn all the other spells. She's sick too, Lord. She going through it. She is. She is. These heifers be going through changes. Maybe like Sir Papa. Oh, why do they do this? What are you doing? Sunlight reversal. Maybe it's that's one she just can't study. Y'all insist on going outside to read these books. Word coins. Damn, this dress gave her some tete. Like she already had tete, but the dress gave her extra tete. I love this little mod so much. Ugh, what are you mad day. about? Scented car. Huh. Study magical tone. Please, ma'am. That dress gave her so much extra today. Huh. Dustify. What does Dustify do? Mischief, magic, deliriate, reach into a sim's head and scramble their thoughts. Hi, Mira. Hey, how the hell are you? How's it going? Over here trying to go through all of these spells and seeing what's up with the different spells. The fridge got green smoke. Uh-oh, the spirits. Burgly eight. Wait, we could rob Sigas. Acquire something that don't belong to you. Summons dust and dust creatures. Okay. The spirits. Okay, let's see. Study magical tome. <laughs> Blood magic. Wait, where are you going with that? I don't know why they keep doing this thing where like they keep coming all the way upstairs to not read the book. Or you coming up here to read? I'm gonna have to put a couch downstairs. Just a regular couch. Okay, yeah, let me put a couch downstairs. Cause it's kind of aggravating seeing them come all the way upstairs to read a book or go all the way in the backyard videos of custom content you use um yes 
so you can check out my YouTube. You could do, I think it should, you should be able to access it by doing the YT command. I have videos on the CC and stuff that I use and where I get things from. I actually did a CC finds video more so for women very recently. And then I did one for men some months back. Okay. So how am I going to do this? Where? So this is supposed to be a master bedroom. So let's do that now. This is Vlad and her, they, that's their bedroom. Um, let me actually start doing some stuff. This is supposed to be the garage, but I'm tempted to make this the lit. No, this could be the living room right here. You're going to throw a couch in there. Get like two beds. Thanks. And you're very welcome. Happy Tuesday to you too. I need three beds and a couch. So let's expand and turn this off so I can see a little bit better. I'm gonna spend some more time doing reshades. I need a reshade for just pictures and a reshade for just gameplay. Double bed untucked. So the girls need their own room. Okay, so these are the girls' rooms. This is Yolanda's room for right now. And Mizuki could just share the space with Yolanda. And then what we'll do is we'll put this in the inventory. This will go right here. This will be the workout corner. The RT stuff will go upstairs. The modem, there's no thing up here. Wait, is there a modem already downstairs? All right, I'll leave that upstairs. This can go in here. Um, what else? What are some other things that we can put in here for the witchy food? Their marriage certificate can go in their bedroom. Um, okay. All right. Crystal charged on the crystal grid. Okay, the seance table can come down here as well. Hmm. I need to find a crystal ball for that table. And set some lighting toning in here. Hmm. Who's this that's dead? Vlad Magumi. Magumi. Ten cans of beer in the inventory. What? What is all this beer? Oh, these things finna be shwasted tonight. Magna Howard University diploma. Who got a degree from Howard? Wait. Okay, trying finally trying Issa Rae's Prosecco and washing my hair. It was good. I want to go back and get some. That's a lot of beer. It is. These little baby Alkies. Um, I kind of want some type of shelving in here. But let me also clean this out. Let this get thrown in the garbage. Who made it? Let these cigars throw that away. 
Vanity set? No. Whose degree is this? Accredited by Howard University. Let me, I'll put it in the world and then see. Um, I'm not putting no more musical instruments down in this house because then we gonna get Justin Timberfake started and I don't feel like that right now. So we won't be doing that. Is everyone still alive? I was driving when the fires broke out. Everyone is still alive, just barely. You know, the house still has remnants of the fire. You know, the destruction and the despair is remained all over the property. But they persevere. They still alive. Okay, so we are back in live mode. What are y'all doing? This is the first time I seen y'all be intimate in days. Oh. I feel like there's some intimacy. Yup, I, I knew it. This little dry ass bottom lip. Bottom lip dry as shit. Okay, you need some acne cream. You might have to um order from Sephora real quick. Oh Jesus, not your cootie just out. We don't need to see that. he oh my god tremor call this how we make an earthquake let's make an earthquake let's do an earthquake there we go yes sir yibs yibs damn this is the most powerful earthquake i think i've ever seen in this damn game hold on Yes, sir. Yibsy. All right, we clean that up. Magic, whirlwind, spell, cut gemstone. Commune with the departed, like all of y'all bring y'all butts in here. I actually eventually want to add a bookshelf in there and have it where they just autonomously sit in there and read the spells. Earthquake and you yelling, yes. Why was it going so long? Rock the boat, don't stop. This house is built for it strong. Earthquakes. Yeah, there's a lot of custom spells that people added over the years. I just got to get my, my fire ass broom replacements back because these actual house brooms ain't it. Study the magical tomes. Which magical tome is that? Sunlight reversal. I don't know if she could study that one. Hushba. Host seances with other sims. Group seance provides increased benefits. Teamwork makes the dream work. Okay, the lights are starting to flicker. Who's she talking to? Don't be talking about, huh? You knew what she was doing. Wouldn't be fun if something terrible happened tonight. Mischief rituals, practice ritual, untamed rituals, communion of shadow. Makes the casters temporarily immortal, may have a bad effect on the Sims around. Curse of eternal despair, steals happiness from other Sims. Changes the eco print to industrial, hex of the wind. Resets the casters progression, may have a bad effect on the Sim. Oh my God. Practice ritual. Mischief rituals. Increases the leader's reputation. Increases the leader's fame. Steals simoleons from the Sims around. Okay. Gives happiness to other Sims. Comes with a price. 
resets the leader's perks, changes the eco footprint to green, turns back time. A time reversal? Yo, okay, untamed. Okay, let's do some, let's do some much shit. Okay. Ceremony of reconfiguration. No, untamed, communion of shadow. Have a bad effect on the Sims around. Let's get it. And while that's happening, I'm gonna mess with the lights. Somebody's missing. Okay. All right, the ritual has begun. Saying I say research these custom potions and spells. Uh oh, uh oh. She back there just working. The lights is flickering. She back there just working on her stuff. She ain't thinking nothing of nothing. Well, that's Sir Pava. Uh oh. Okay, so far it's okay. Neep, neep. Have y'all messed with any of these uh mods? What's she peeking at? Close your eyes. Will you mess up the damn spell? Uh oh. Uh oh. The magic ritual failed. Oh Jesus. Not y'all failed the ritual. Uh oh. Now they mad scared because the ritual fail. Oh, Christ. Y'all, we might, these sickers might die. Luckily, I think some of them have the ability to like bring each other back if somebody gets clapped. Hey, Mira, hey. How the hell are you? I feel like, not ruh -ruh. Now she giving me that Scooby Dooby Doo. Where are you? You got some work to do now. It was a spell that's supposed to have a good effect on them, but may have a negative effect on the Sims around them. Um, I'm going to have to go back and look at it because that ritual thing, there's a lot of rituals. Trying to find like darker walls. Hey, y'all. Hey, how the hell are you? How are you? Pretty good. Trying to figure out if I want to spend time making this space look a bit more witchy or do I want to just put them in a new space altogether? Trying to figure it out and get myself together. Um, shades of orange, classical paint set, wall mural. That's nice. These, these walls ain't dark enough for me. Maybe it's just, it's too much lights in the room or something. That's why it's good to experiment with different lights because different lights give you different tones, different results, different shaboing boings. Um, we gonna, it's, it's giving grandma's house. Yes. No, no, not grandma's house. Hmm. This is definitely giving going to visit grandma in Florida. Okay. No. Maybe, you know what? We, we might have to just hit the trusty. Is the trusty base game thingy? Ooh, wait. 
Hold the hell up. I don't know if it's just because of my reshade, but like if you see that, that's kind of cool. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, house already caught fire. It might be time to move. That was the spirits. Because they dabble with the spirits, it doesn't matter where they live. They they knew how it's gonna get caught on fire too. Um, that that don't matter. Yeah, they was messing with a spirit. If you notice the the demon, it was a demon that was running around lighting the house on fire. Yeah, the spirit got mad because I don't know if they don't have a proper relationship with the spirit to be starting that fire, or they didn't have a high enough magical skill, or they're not. Um, well versed in traditional witchcraft because I have a traditional witchcraft mod too and they're not well versed in it enough to be playing around calling on um the demon so the demon got mad and said yo like stop playing with me I'm not playing with you and then they started the fire and I was like damn you know what I'm saying why I had to be you um let me see some. I want to take a bookcase. Maybe I'll snatch this one. Make it black if I can. Grab a couch because we need a couch. This was supposed to be living room, but I'm finna put a couch in here. I'm just trying to see if we can get like a enough space to do all of these things in this one room so i don't have to because i don't know i kind of want them to just be in this one area i don't really want them like all over the house doing the witchy stuff i kind of want it to be in one spot again got nice shiny wallpapers it's pretty oh so the etsy mod okay so with the etsy mod um if i'm not mistaken it is coco games who did an Etsy mod text override. You would have to check out her website and stuff and drink some damn water. Okay, I'm gonna moisten it, I'm gonna moisten them. Mm -mm. Pasta check to Infinity Sims, what's up? To infinity and beyond. Gotta keep it moist. It's drying out. And I can't believe it's seven o'clock. Blizzard's so sick of our shit, Seth. Mm -mm -mm. Glad I was able to catch a stream. Glad you were able to catch a stream as well. <laughs> I'm just laughing at chat right now. They are best. And I'm trying to find, cause like I said, different lights give different tones, right? So like you got the lights that give like a more of an isolated glow. And you've got lights that give more of a pronounced glow, like all the lights. I think for years, we just, a lot of us just grab these types of lights and just tack, 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 tack them all over the place. And don't even really look at like what the other lights can do as far as how the light is distributed and how it can really um, bring out an environment and make an environment look good or look how you want it to look in this sense like you know what i'm saying it brings out the the realism if you will so where am i going to find a nice light this might work but nothing this light is not it's not giving off no light that's just decoration child yeah that's not even a Hope you're doing good. I'm doing pretty swell. How are you? Trying to 
trying to get my witches things popping. Classic wood broom. How have you been? Okay, I think that's Hmm, okay. What should I? Okay, so that's a a uh, bookcase and then what did I say I wanted a couch if I could fit a couch along that wall I wish the sims 4 had an online save where I can access my save from another computer I want to play my save right now but I'm not at home oh you mean like a cloud save because every other I was not every other game but most other games have cloud saves I think you have to probably set it up but like if I sign into Steam on another computer and I download a game, it usually downloads whatever I was doing on the last computer I played it on. Is Sims is one of the only games that doesn't seem to have that feature. I wonder if the size of Sim saves have anything to do with that though, because to be honest, my Sim save is literally nine gigs right now. So I wonder how much of like I, I wonder how much like the sizes of our saves have to do with that because my save big as hell y'all it big it big okay not that sofa that's too big this ain't no club my save is probably around that too. I was just digging through my files this morning because you know, I told y'all I've been cleaning out my mods folder bit by bit. And like, I have a program that shows me the exact sizes of all my folders. So like when I looked in my save folder, it said my save folder was nine gigs. And I'm like, yo, my main save, that gotta be all my main save. Because I have a couple of other saves on the side, but like none of them I played with much, so. I'm like, that's definitely this main save that is majority of that. Um, let me, that not toffee sofa, that's too modern. That is also kind of modern. Not the kitty cat couch. This don't look comfortable to me. Like graphics wise, it's a beautiful couch. It was it's very well made, but it definitely don't look comfortable to me. I kind of want it to look a little dusty in here. So, you know, it's gonna look a little dusty and crusty. Sure, everything is accessible so they can still reach the things that they need. I will put a what you call it there later a nice couch for the demons to chill on. Oh, my God. Who is outside with a missing body? That y'all hoes missing bodies. Don't do this. Don't do that. Put your put your body back and stop playing with me. Don't 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 start. Small abstract painting. Nah, whoever did this little painting, it can go upstairs in the painting corner. Y'all be getting intimate with y'all little paintings and whatnot. Gonna snatch some decor other parts of the house uh, and throw it over here to make it look a bit more lived in 
She got her Gary slippers on, Gare Bear, you know what I'm saying? My my Sega Gare Bear, he is cared for. Damn, maybe we should keep the, uh, Hmm. I don't want it to. Yeah, we we might keep the um keep the crystals right in front of there. But damn, whatever door that was, we was gonna put that one. But yeah, that's what I think it is. Like just the big ass saves. Um. Hold on, what? Okay. One, two. The door is dark. And the core, the core, the core. Nice house, nicer houses. Mines look so plain. I'm working on it. I be just trying to improve and like, oh yeah, no, because if we put the door there, how are they gonna get outside? Well, we'll see. If they do, if they don't use the door, then we know they can't access it, and they can't use it. A nice couch for the demons to chill on. Um, I just need some rugs. But yeah, I just be trying to improve. Like, um, I be trying to improve on like making my spaces look as lived in as I can or <clears throat> making things look cozy how I can. Wait, where was that from? Uh, <clears throat> let's see, pastel rug. No, no, no. Um, mm. is that newspapers? Chips and sheets. And I have not saved. Oh, yeah, let's save. All right. Whew. Let me take a deep breath and figure this out. Do I want to add another rug under? Y'all, I'll be, I'll be stressed out. <laughs> I'll be stressed out trying to figure this out. It's like putting pieces. Decorating is like putting pieces together to a puzzle and trying to figure out how you want the pieces to fall and... I always get confuddled when it comes to this. Always get confuddled. So, uh, can I put this on top? No. Damn. Hold on. Like, you want to be on top? No, 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 no. Damn. I like the darkness of the table, but I'm probably going to put it back to that red and brown situation. Maybe like the deep. Deep brown. Deep 
can really mix it up, if you will. Alright, let me get the hell out of Dubai. I feel like this is, wait, I'm like, I feel like this is okay. And then I'll be like, ooh, just, ooh, 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 just one more thing, just one more thing, just one more thing. Family home for four because they want to make babies with no baby making money. Yeah, that's one thing too. I had to turn down sex autonomy because all, if you don't, if you don't like try to regulate your Sims a little bit, you will look up and they would just be constantly getting busy, constantly getting busy, constantly getting intimate. You look up and they just, they just fuck it. Like you can't just be doing the do every 10 seconds. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? Like it's, you can't be intimate all, all damn day. It's, it's like, you can't, you, you can't just live to be intimate. And that's the, that's the problem with some of these figures that they just live to be intimate. I leave for three days and now she's pregnant. And, and that's what I'm talking about. Like these Sims be just balls to the wall. And I'm like, you know, you, you got to put your little simulacy down and you, you got to stop that. You, you can't, can't do that. Um, and they just don't be stopping. They don't be caring. I'm like, okay, asking for subs don't help. It make me want to throw them out of the house. Yeah. I had to turn my wicked women's autonomy all the way down. Like, like real, real down. Cause no, they was doing too much. I'm like, nah. I'm like, y'all are wild horny for no reason. Back in full effect, I'm off now. Autonomously hunch what what they won't go to the toilet when they bought the pee them so yo yo so it's not just me okay cause they they got sex autonomy they be having sex autonomy till the cows come home but then when it comes to using the bathroom they standing there talking about Nabakuzi ho oh, quick like no you no damn well you could go pee you're actively choosing to ignore going to the bathroom because you want to go get intimate you're actively choosing to ignore. is this the sims 2 poster it is teen angst husband will call and ask if she want to come back to watch a movie oh wow not to watch a movie scam. That's a scam. That's how you get scammed out of pussy. Watch a movie. That's a scam. Mm. Trying to get some peen and go piss through. Listen. Kids doing out here in the streets anyway. They would drop starving before they reject sex. And I'm like, is this how humans be acting? Cause these Sims are actually wilding right now. Like, is this how these human figures be acting? Cause I'm not understanding. It's just not clicking to me. Notice that too, UI cheats, because if not, they won't take care of their needs. 
how many mods do y'all have? Cause I know sometimes that when we have too many mods that control autonomy, especially if we're over time, we're not really looking at what other mods control the same autonomy. It creates autonomy issues amongst your Sims. So like basic stuff they would struggle to do because one, one script mod is telling them to go this way. But the other script mod is telling them to go that way. That's why sometimes it got it where they look like they just kind of freeze. Four, maybe five, way too many. Yeah, I would I would say go and look and see if you having them type of problems and just take everything out for a bit and then look at how like the Sims behave after a while and you'll see if it's the mods or it's just the game. Sometimes it do be the game, but sometimes it be the mods. Four or five, actually. Not they getting intimate. I seen that. And that's the backsplash. Zodiac signs, paintings and posters, paintings and posters. Pop posters, theme sim violence. You talking about, um, what are you talking about? Um, 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 survival house. That's what you talking about? Yeah. I put extreme violence back, but I haven't tested it yet. I haven't tested it to see how it's going to behave. Because the last time I did test it, it's been updated like once since then. But the last time I did test it, it was like really laggy, really bad. Like to the point where I'm actually like wondering if that is what's been bugging out my game for the past few days. Cause the past two or three days, my game has been like bugging the fuck out and it might just be that mod might have to take that ride back out again. Might have to yoink that sucker. Game still crash when I try to search an object that's in build mode. So yeah, you that means you put something broken in your um game. Your best bet is if you absolutely positively do not want to wipe out your mods folder, right? Your best bet is to probably I don't know, go through um what's that shit? Uh Sims 4 Studio. But that's why I have a tendency that like I don't organize my stuff immediately. What I tend to do is put it in like folders based on a date. And what happens is, is that if the, I go in game, I put in a new batch of things. I go in game, I search and build by mode. I do a couple of things. If it crashes, I know that it's something that I just put in that day. So I'll get rid of, um, the folder and then I go back again and if it's not crashing I know okay it's definitely something from whatever's that's how I tend to do it nowadays to kind of prevent that because I I hate there's nothing I hate more than that you go and build by you already you decorating you go to search something and the game just immediately just crash on you it sucks. It really, truly sucks. Where are the vines at? Is it this? No, that's a different set of vines. Where are my OG vines that I use? I think that's Severinka's vines. Yo, Severinka. Oh, no, it's not Severinka. Their name is Muki or something. I about to say Severinka has been clutched for years. Meanwhile.
I'm just messing up the window. Maybe even a curtain. Oh no, I was supposed to be in Dubai for a few minutes and we didn't damn near finished a room. Snack time. Go get a snack. Wait, I don't have no, I, I mean, well, um, I'm probably just gonna get off soon and then go get some food, food. I'm about to say, I don't think I wanna get a snack. I actually wanna go eat. Piece of fruit will do. I don't even have any fruit that's not frozen. So it's bad in here. I have a bad tendency of like, a bad tendency of like fruit goes bad a lot in this house. So I just get frozen fruit for a smoothie. I'm not starving. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna get me a all right, I'm gonna order me a pork bowl. Hold on. Let me do it off my iPad. That's not frozen. You must a lot of yeah, I I be freezing fruit. Cause I have a bad tendency to buy things and like forget I buy it. And then they go bad. So I just I'll be like, okay, um, it's time for me to get some fruit. Frozen fruit, frozen fruit. How is these things not laying on the wall how they supposed to? Even this one, this is like corner pieces. Why is these all corner pieces? And then they not even laying in the correct damn corners. Like, why is this doing this? Oh, okay, I could try to. Oh, nah, it's still floating off the, off the joint. Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. How is it not? Boo, boo. On the avenue. Freezing food is just responsible. Cauldron functional, yes. It absolutely is. I'm changing this rug. This might be too much to line up the walls. All right. Now, when I get back into game, And this is not the final, this is not the final room. I'm still gonna move some stuff around and look for some witchy decor. I still have to find my functional sage and some more stuff, but I'm going to order me a pork bowl before um, I get suplex. And I don't wanna get suplex. So like the roasted pork rice block and a matcha almond milk drink and uh yeah that that'll be my my little meal for today so i don't get suplex and let's give that a, a nice tip there you know we yeah you get that it looks so nice it yeah it's pretty cool okay so we are back in the game Let's mess with lighting. This light, we're gonna make the lights lower, darker and lower. The primary light can come all the way down. Get that blue. What's lighting this room up like this still? It's still not dark enough in here for me. Yeah, there's something still. I think there's like a light that I can't see possibly. Cause like, it's still too bright in here. What you terrified? Oh, not y'all terrified. Read something using magic, study a magical tone. And then it's pouring outside. Oh, girl, hush. Study magical tone. What's in this one? 
Yeah, get out your homework and go study the magical tome. You can go back to making your jewelry. Whirlwind design jewelry. Charged on the crystal grid. Metal. Obtainium crystal. Fire opal. Let's start with what you got on you. Cut a gemstone. You got to get them skills up with that moonstone. Also need to go and build by and make the, the crystals smaller. So they're not so in, invasive and big and in the way. Never seen that familiar before. Yeah, um, some I think I well, no, I don't think I have the custom familiars anymore, but I do have familiar overrides. So it changes the appearance of some of the familiars. Seasons, Parenthood, and Laundry Day. Ooh. Did she run off to bed? Oh my God. Why is her magic bursting like that? So, so cash it. Final stage of charge. Also chance of death by overload. Magic carefully. All right. First of all, this is your bed. So you need to go sleep in it. Terrified. What's that? Overcharge risk. That was a close call. Dangerously overcharged. All right. So we don't want you to die. So go to bed. Everybody's scared because of the possible death by overload. I need y'all girls to relax. Yeah, Agnew. You know, she going to make some coconut rice. Relax. Tribna. What's going on with you? Where's your body at? So you just finna be out here with nobody? You giving body, but you ain't got nobody? Why are you standing in the rain like a dickhead? Severe disease, bacterial disease. Oh Lord, they gonna have to get you to go to the hospital. You got a bacterial infection? Girl, go to the people. You better go to them people. Entire passages written in indecipherable language. That's probably in vampire, in vampire lingo. Dental. Senior living vision services, dental services, healthcare services. We gotta get you, we gotta get you some healthcare insurance. Go ahead. No top roof gone head ass. Yeah, she uh you you going to the general practitioner. You go by yourself. Why are you taking pictures of these books? You tripping. You are tripping. And he just sitting over here twiddling his thumbs, Mr. Mr. Vlad Timberlake. Light beer. He finna get wasted though, cause he finna drink these. Plum Bob and the Gucci is crazy. Yes, that Plum Bob Punani. Why is your spell casting overloaded? Y'all ain't doing no more rituals tonight. Y'all gotta relax on the magic. Ain't no damn yibs. This girl finna die. She got electricity coming out her ass. You, you not doing no more magic rituals. You're grounded from doing magical rituals for a while. Zorgone captions. Um, I don't know. I, um, I guess on Twitch you would use the, the wheel. It's like a little cog wheel. magic all she can do is whirlwind and commune with the departed she can't really do much in that realm we just need everybody to step away and go to sleep now you go back to being a regular teenager for a while sir pava sinusitis girl treat that with antibiotics make spoiled Why can't we make anything in the Kava Bowl? Reach cleaning level three, bacterial disease. And inventory. What did y'all put in here? What is it here? Steam rice, take it out. And get your ass off Stardew. I, I knew you, I know you on Stardew. Stop star doing it. Well, then again, honestly, you probably could just get back on. Who's coughing? Are you just over here? You sick? The spirits is trying to get at you. 
you stressed out they gave you some antibiotics you don't got no body but as long as i could click on you they could drink from you you out here going through it where they bodies at i don't know where her body at umbrella through the legs though torso she just out here why is peeping tom bro i know i said that nobody in here was supposed to be doing magic but when i tell you i'm tired of peeping tom i am tired of peeping tom bro i'm finna i'm finna electrocute his ass one good time empathize furio witch bolt minionize scrubberoo Let's pull out the witch bolt on his ass. We tired of him. Bro, just go down there and work that magic. How you gonna electrocute a ghost? Tom, deceased, still peeping. And it's raining too? Sick of his shit. Where he go? Wait, where he go? She hit him, but he gone. He's some I don't know where he at. He got the fuck on. I peeped that. Yeah, he ran. Nah, he ran. But based on her reaction, would tell me if she got him. She got his ass. He tried to run off, little baby back bitch. Clean with vigor. Yo, she sounds so stressed out. I'm going a, I'm to a just not let her. um, Bro, if you don't banish his ass, it, nothing works. He comes back in another form, ready to diddle his fiddle. He comes back as a ghost beating off. He comes back like he comes back in all forms, messing with his situations. And I'm tired of it. Baby back ribs, collard greens, mac and cheese and coleslaw. All right, we are going to have everybody eat. Um, everybody come eat. You repair the sink. And then you can get some food. Does this work? Does regular cold to meal work anymore? Or do I have to do this? Why is peeping Tom showing up in the thing? So all. Got the steam rice sitting here. Put away. Damn, Yvonne got a rump on her. She got to relax with all that rump. Oh, yeah, he can't eat. Oh, he can't eat this. Bombo, charm. <laughs> he, he can't eat human food. He, he sure could drink him some alcohol, though. He, he's, he, oh, that's probably why he's stomach messed up. Bust down buds. Is she finished repairing? Anya Mills is called in the chat, want to answer. Bud Light, my dad used to love that. Bud Light be hitting sometimes. The Miller Light. All the lights be hitting sometimes. All right, well, you could take his plate. That's what we'll do. And then the rest of y'all have to clean up. We don't need nobody dying from magic overload. You get yourself ready, cause he's gonna come for his dinner soon. I'm gonna get him drunk. Have him drink all 10 of these cans. And then clean up the ones that ain't available. All right, what you over here doing? Good fortune. Okay, learning them spells. I see you, sis. She working on her crystals. She don't need to eat. They they don't eat human food. Charge on your crystal grid. getting into me oh the crystals got her horny oh lord can she go out this door yes uh, gibbs 
Wait, not you running inside. Open umbrella. Oh, I hate the umbrellas, bro. So we can get all the crystals and all the jewels outside in the rain on the thing. So when the nighttime comes, put that lunar goddess necklace out here too. Embarrassed mood lit. Put all of this outside. All of it. Ain't no damn tripna. Put everything outside. Is yours? Okay, your necklace you have on, it says 12 days remaining. And we don't, I don't think we have anything for potions as of yet. Vampire potions. Cook, experiment. Back to experimenting. Overcharged. Is she still overcharged? Is she still busting out the seams with magic? I wonder if that overcharge applies to them practicing magic as well. Or is it just... I don't know. I wonder how much that applies. I might reversal. For some reason, these, these sigas can't read this. Do your homework. Is there a reason why you... Okay. There's so many different spells for them to pick up. Let's see. Study magical tone. Why she keep going? Where is she going with this? Is there a reason why you came in here? I'm getting rid of this chair. Why are they not just sitting in the chair closest to get out of here? What? I didn't just sit up here and add beds for you to pick your frowsy ass up and come trying to lay. No, go out of here. You scram skedaddle. That's why she didn't sit there. Well, it's fine. Cause I'm getting rid of this chair. Why these dumb ass sims keep going to sit in the rain? Bro. Study a magical tone. All right. Well, the headless Henrietta, she's outside. Monique was a real bully. She has learned to revel in scaring other Sims and no longer feels guilty about it. What? New potion. Let's try it out. So you unleash that wig on everybody. And you think that that was okay? You really thought that that wig was like acceptable? Oh my God. He just get drunk and start singing. All right, you need to relax. He's like, I don't want to be in here no more. I want to sing my songs. She's just trying to be a bully. Like why is she being a bully? Who texting you, girl? Read. Power of the blood magic. What you got going? Am I good enough? Why does this not go away? What mod is this? I feel like it's probably a deep indigo or something. What she keep talking about? Am I good enough? Disappointing your parents. What? To borrow Watanini. She looks so sad. Mm. Waking up and choosing violence for no ass reason. Pretty tasty from eating food. But why is the picture of a photographer? Wait, what? You know what? Okay, Tremor Call. You know what Tremor Call is, right? This is what Tremor Call is. Tremor Call. Turn it up, sis. Show these, show these singers what you about with your base game fro. Show them what time it is. Zubara Watsonini. There we go. Damn, you ain't even get to do the spell properly. Oh, shit. Wait. You, girl? Oh! Oh, my God. Now this making my head spin. Hold on. Relax. Relax. 
That shit actually gave me a headache. Hold on, wait. Oh my God. All right, y'all Nairobi, not Mary, not again. Yes, again, again, again. Delicioso, Negro call, ancient vampire, a skeleton, Dustify, Herbio, Sherman Cole, and 38 Transporter Lake. Who we bringing back? Is that an earthquake mod? It's an earthquake spell. Girl, do the spell. Stop. Don't dance around it. Who is this? Ancient vampire elder. Command to turn into vampire. Command to fight. Not Phoenix Huerta. Go beat up Phoenix then. Now he a teen looking like that. He a teen looking like that. That nigga look like he got a mortgage. Still after 600 years. Who's charging like this? Harry Potter world. Which Harry Potter world? Not Megamind. He got a big ass head. He got a lot on his mind. Hell, Megamind, get the fear. Listen. Oh, is this Harvey? No, this Phoenix. This Harvey little brother. Oh, shit. Wait, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> That young man, 600 years old. Well, I mean, this ain't ancient vampire, so I'm gonna assume he a couple hundred years old. Oh no, he tearing his ass up. What happened to Vladdy Vlad? This one of Vlad cousins from back in the day. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Oh, he beat his ass. How you gonna let him beat up on him like that? Command to turn into vi vampire. Release, command to vampire duel. Command to garden, command to fight. That would be wild if he turned Phoenix into a vampire. She finna bust the spell. He finna turn Phoenix into a vampire. Ooh, wee. Oh, this nigga is hideous. He look like a, a malnourished nipple. Damn, what happened to that mod where the Sims just passed out? He ain't even pass out from it. You got three days. He finna be a vampire. Hold up, he fine. He is. Um, I'm kind of scared to open up MC command. So just to be sure, I'm going to save. And in case MC command decides that it wants to bug out, I'm going to just close up the stream there. I seen some glitter. It's not eyeshadow. It is his rings colliding with his eyelashes. The, the silver rings on his finger, the color is showing up in his eyelashes. See? See them pa big ass patches of silver? That's what's happening. So we're gonna change his outfit so y'all can see what he, how I dressed him and then yeah, this is him. This is his outfit or whatever. He has lashes. So certain jewelry clashes with the lashes. And it looks weird on the eye. Neep, neep. Not the outfit giving the young and the restless. Please. Harry Potter world with you. Okay, I got y'all. Um. Folks that are coming into the Discord, y'all should have the roles. Damn, a Deep Indigo did some mod updates today. Ooh, wee! Connected Sims, Divergent Sims, Healthcare Redo, and Golden Years. All right, I got some mods to update. And I got some things I need to take out. What the hell is a Morcubus? If y'all heifers are tired, get in the bed and go to sleep. All this ha. The whole house need a reset. I should really get going now. Who are you? Who even invited you, dude? What is wrong? Wait, what about being mad? Hold on. 
damn, she had a lot going on. I was trying to see something and they just said no. All right, quick bath and then get to your bed. Why is Mizuki? Well, no, I did say Mizuki can stay in that bed. All this deep sighing. Everybody deep sighing. Deep sigh y'all asses in a bed. Everybody tell my, ah, ah. Oh, girl, body missing. You, you still got the disease? We hope we don't get clapped because who, who gonna be the supply if you over there clapping yourself? You, you can't be dead because you you bring joy and blood to the residents of the household. I need to find those blood packets. I need to find the blood bags. So they don't got to suck up on Sims so much. All right, she washing up her cooter nanner and everybody's in rest mode. We are going to put things on high speed and let everybody go to sleep. Cooter Nanner improving and she feels a bit better. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Oh, you just recently watched the Sims competition? Yeah, that shit, it was stressful. It was, it was stressful. Um, yeah, I think the biggest challenge was just getting people who normally play a single player game to like come together and work together and realize that like yeah this is a single player game but this ain't a single player project we gotta listen to each other um read the vampire books and get level four for them to appear on a computer i appreciate that because i forgot about that the vampire lore books let me actually look up now do i have no i think i only have there we go. I need two and three vampire tones. Yeah, but just having to remind people like, yeah, this is a single player game, but we got to work together here. So we got to work together. We got to get it together. There we go. Read. She never came out of dark form. Her eyes been white for like three business days. You just said, I'm comfortable. I'm cozy in dark form and I'm staying that way. I see the reds of your eyes. I'm actually scared. Back titties quivering just a tad. What is going on here? Learned everything she can about vampires from this book. She too calm. Who is this? I know peeping Tom, bro. And what's glowing inside of him? Why is he glowing on the inside? I'm going to suplex him so bad, bro. Where is that? Um, where's that? That vintage vampire slave she had i'm finna have him back out on on peeping tom bro i'm tired where to do that because i know he probably still around here with his big head ass damn he left he gone no he oh he back here wait now he an elder he was just a teen he making he over here making, oh my God, what are these? Again, de-stress and concoctions and peeping in the afterlife. Drink uncontrollably, command to vampire duel. Yo, that'd be wild. It's like, yo, I hate my stepdad. Can you beat his ass in a fight? Damn, he can't do none of this stuff to him because he is a freaking ghost. Command to cook, command to clean. Well, wake up and tell him to clean. Peep it Tom actually being creepy. You know, he need his ass beat. 
her mama should be downstairs somewhere still reading. Hey, dude, yeah, I'm tired of him. Extreme violence don't get him up out of here. Nothing gets him. Like, he just be just macking. And I'm like, no, like, you need to get clapped. He should not be able to come back in the afterlife with his situations out in the window. Vampire tone. Vampire lore level 30. Damn, level 13. Girl, you up there. I was going to have her clean that up, but if Frederick will come clean it up, then if let Frederick just clean the house. Volume three, Operation High Fang. What the hell is this? Ultimate Vampire Tone. What's this? Here they go, sitting on these beds, reading these books. Vampire lore can disable him now. I'm thinking about doing that, but I do enjoy beating his ass. I do enjoy cl clapping him, but I feel like it should be something in the code that says, all right, if you killed him, he got to chill. At least some type of downtime. We're like, for like a good week, we don't see him or something. Tried to unalive him too. Then my sims start acting crazy. What you mean? Wait. Oh no. Custom nuptial. She reads faster than my spellcaster. Magic, whirlwind, lifestyle brand, password security, online learning, careers and education, hobbies and skills. Where is it at? Shop, vampire tomes. Elf plasma packs. Yeah, we need that. Cause we can't keep sucking on people like this all day. I also need to find the mod that provides more um filling plasma packs. I'll be right back. My food is here. Don't eat blizzard too much. Your face conjures. Right, she's a vampire and a spellcaster. What mod allows them to be both? It's a mod by Zero called um, Vampire Witch, and that's what I'm actually testing right now, trying to see if it works. Pork roll, ooh, pork roll. Oh no, I said pork bowl. It's like um season. Pork over rice, vegetables, peppers, with like a little matcha tea drink on the side that is super delish. It's an outfit. I was always told that it was sliders that does that. I was always told that it was sliders. Did she drink the plasma? Okay, she did. She need to give him some. Because he start walling out. And damn, I can't do multi-select and give partial, whatever. We're gonna pass that to him. Have him drink like three of them things, because he is going through it. Yeah, get up. 
Was that the ghost of Peeping Tom? Yes. Hey, Mira. Hey, chat. Hey. Peeping Tom is toasted up in the window. You said a rundown? Okay. Her and her man vampires. That's cute. All right. We're going to start with these two. So... This is like the matriarch of the household, Evangelia. She's got a couple of sisters. Some of them are witches. Some of them are vampires. Some of them are both. They even have sisters and half sisters who are aliens on a mama side. Let me see if I could pull up the um thing so y'all can see the aliens. Banish the spirit with the headstone. I'm I'm bounced too. So Evangelia, she has her sister Yavana. Um, they had a little sister Malaya, and then um Diana, and then there's Nova and Nebula, who are the alien sisters. So Nova O'Kane and Nebula O'Kane. And Evangelia had Jamie. This is her daughter. Um, well, she sleep, but and then their cousin Yana decided to live with them, you know, to try to get a better education. They realized at some point Yana was also a young spellcaster and they wanted her to make sure, you know, make sure she get the best education. And they concluded that she would get the best education as a spellcaster and just to be a more well-rounded teen and adult living with Evangelia. And so Yovana's her sister who is also asleep. Vlad is Evangelia's husband and Vlad is evil. Like he is no good, low down, evil, he is evil to everybody except for his wife. He is a piece of shit to everybody. And I'm going to show you just how much. If you look to the right, every relationship is negative except for his wife and this mystery baby that we still trying to get the location on. Apparently he cheated. I think he cheated. Cause where this baby come from? It's the miscellaneous baby. Cause you was throwing some cack around town. And now we gotta find this baby. But yeah, no, he's terrible. Everybody hates him. I've never seen no shit like that in my life. All the years I've been playing Sims 4, I've never seen everybody just hate one Sim like that. Even down to his stepdaughter, her cousin, everybody. Because all he do, he don't care. He will drink from Sims in broad daylight in public. She do it too, but she's not as hated as him. You see what I'm saying? Like, she got some people that look and be like, oh, no. Wait, when did MG's wife die? Nibs, yum, sir. Oh, Lord, they done kill MG wife. Did they even give you a death by? But you know, Peeping Tom is aggravated. You see him just sitting there? His frothy ass. Move. Dig up remains? Excuse me? Hold on. Mm-mm. What you mean, dig up remains? This is some extreme violence business. Hold on. Dig up remains. It look like only she got the option to do it. So maybe it's not extreme violence. What you mean, dig up remains? Hold on. Let me get the tea on this one. Not wicked on the tomb. Child wicked is everywhere. 
Self Sim was getting it on on top of the robotics machine the other day. Now I'm here for the Simussy. Mm -mm. She digging up a dead body. Hold on. What's finna come out? Oh! Not you dug up his bones? Wait. Necromantic. Berry remains. Wait, what is the necromantic right? Hold on. That, that, what, what is that? Now I gotta Google. Next thing you know, she in love with him and I don't know what's happening. That's how you get a curse. I'm scared. Necromancy? Mm -hmm. All right. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna save. So that if it's something that I'm not okay with, I just won't save. That's how we do that. I will end the stream. Mm-hmm. This is wild morbid. Okay. I like it. I need something different. All that he he yib jib. All right, what you finna do? I'm tired of this dude playing with his Peter Pickle in my window. What we finna do about his spirit? We don't need no ghost nut on the windows. Deal with him. Mm-hmm. Get him out of here. Not this some Shannon. <laughs> mm -mm. Girl, you put a mask on? Y'all. Oh, this shit is serious. He said, I will not be getting Simrona. Mm -mm. I still want to know what's going to happen. Sing song. She don't want to inhale the ashes. I notice he's not playing with his Peter Pickle in the window no more. Potion of Levitation. Crimson right. Restores blood level based on the relationship with the deceased. The stronger the relationship, the more blood is restored. Oh, wow. Very mm -hmm. remains. Oh, practice. Okay, so what is this? So it's just a pra that was just practice. All right. I rebuke this in the name of Jesus. Mm-hmm. But if anybody deserves it, it's peeping Tom. I love this. Honestly, same. He a creep. He could weed on his Peter Wacker in hell. Let him go. And I think this is only with blood magic, so nobody else can do this but her. Because she is a vampire. She has access to magic that nobody else does, unless you are a vampire witch and you have access to blood magic. I guess that's how this ties into the blood magic. What the hell? What he cheering about? What, nigga, you still here? Sip 
See, now you acting like Vlad. Chill out. Oh, I'm sorry. Destroy I'm it. Sorry. Uh, we don't need to yeah. mess with him no more. Hopefully his ghost will stop coming around. <clears throat> she dug his body up and did some practicing. But honestly, I feel like when she gets her necromancy up, she's going to have like ghost servants, which actually we didn't need to get a necromancy up. I could have just clicked on the, um, I just could have clicked on the tombstone and, and did that to be honest. So the crystals are glowing. That's good. And we're back in the lab. Just be me. I work to my employees. She's my favorite. Love her. It's mod, it got all the magic mods. It's nice. It's fun. It's just fun, especially when you just like experimenting, trying to see what still works, what's good, what's not. Rest in hell, peeping time. Right. Yeah. You playing Stardew? Okay. I had to watch these Sims on the computer. I caught the sister watching porn. I was like, what you doing? She watching Womb Raider. I'm like, you know what? I'm finna destroy this computer and y'all won't be watching anything. You don't be sitting up here watching booty movies on a Tuesday. This is, you still got kids in here. Play some damn Stardew. Sick of these damn Sims. Girl. Just clean the house. Sick of y'all shit. I don't know what happened. I think it's something with the slider. She just disappeared mid-session. It is pure insanity. I was flabbergasted. Kapuna. Half her body go. I don't know. Almost missed the stream. Oh, yeah, because I'm about to go because it's been five hours. All right, I'm going to leave at five hours for real for um, Omni Blizzard coming in and suplexing me. Is that you smelling like Dorito chips? Are you smelling like vinaigrette chips? Yo, you ever just be chilling and somebody smell like vinaigrette toes? I gotta fix her body or something. Her ass a little too big for her legs. I gotta either bring her butt down. Oh, not the demons attacking you. Half of you. She's the cattle. For those, when I did the introduction, I forgot to introduce her. She's the cattle. So she she be getting visited by the spirits. She be crying. She going through it. You know what I'm saying? She she's tormented right now. A tormented soul, if you will. She used to sell coochie down in San Mashuno. And now she she's just unlucky, bro. Do the jerk dance, leg on legs. Y'all is terrible. Who is sneezing? How many of y'all can actively thing on this thing together? Shaking in her leggings. I follow you on TikTok. I ain't even put two and two together. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> that is me. Woohoo! Aha! The jerk dance leggings only is actually diabolical, though. Selling that Simwissy down at the Blue Pump Bar. But yeah. Um, when he came and told about Simwissy, it's because. I was on, on Twitter, they saw on Twitter the clip from the Barbie Dream, uh, the Barbie Dream House. Well, it is Barbie Dream House, the Barbie Legacy gameplay, where I was like, how you just gonna throw that Simusi without a bond him? You can't just be throwing that little Simusi around like that. Damn. It was like Simusi, who talks like this? And I'm like, me.
The Gary slippers. Yes, Gear Bear. Where'd you get the hat from, Bob? Curse, not Curse Forge. Um, Nexus mod. I'm just still stuck on Imush Imuno. How your titty eat the tea like that? Titty ate the hell out the tea. It's supposed to be emotional. And titty said, nah, Imuno. She got Gear Bear on her feet. Golden girl needs stop me from having a hot girl summer. Now you know damn well you too young to have that on your shirt. Likes deception, yes she do. Oh yeah, where the I at? Yeah, it's just straight up say Imunu. Mm -mm. That camera click gonna take me out every time. What? <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. I also feel Imuno. Like, why these niggas like this? Oh, did I tell y'all Vlad decided he was gonna become a lawyer? Oh, it's it's Monday now. Everybody gotta go back to school. Imuno Tuesday. Lad is the lawyer. He works in law. That tracks. Not that tracks. They was like, you need something to do with yourself. Go get a job. So he went to go be a lawyer. He ain't got no degree or nothing. That boy finessed his way into that law office. The law offices of Llama and Llama. Your honor, no, why would you say that? Why would you say that? Did she just pee herself or she just stink? Girl, you can't be out here smelling like this. Wait, chat with ancient. Yeah, did you ever even get to know him? You could, you could have one conversation with him because I don't feel like, yes, you didn't never introduce yourself to him. Can you even talk to him? No, you can't. Just command him to clean and then go clean your butt. I just realized that, like, you can't. Girl, you better clean up that cooter nanner. There we go. Boom. Wash your butt. Go to school. You're going to be a little bit late. But your ass isn't going to smell like Scooby Snacks. You're just going to go and you're going to wash. You know what I'm saying? Narugaba, a, a bar of soap. Yeah. She gotta wash her cheeks. She's stinking up the place. Uh -huh. Are these Sims from Nola? No, why you say that? You just reminded me. I need to see if this voodoo witch um, mod still works too. I need to see if the voodoo mod still works. Where the hell do I get a um voodoo doll from? Anybody remember where you get a voodoo doll from? It's a trait. Mm. It's a mod, but computer. Okay. Sometimes it just be too much stuff and I'll be forgetting. I need to see if that still works. Uh, shop on Amazon. We ain't got no money. Yo, we don't have no money. Where is the money at? Hold on. Hello? Mm-mm. It's time to start selling stuff. Go, go outside. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Less likely to deliver it. Uh, no, sell it. Star-shaped gemstone. Vampire Sims, no, that stays. We don't need. Oh, 
complete dates more successfully sell all of that Bye chat by mirror. Thank you for stopping by mother low. Maybe order five peeps and no one got cash I don't know where the money came from who died wait Why she just got so sad where she talking about one of her friends died Purchase tea purchase vampire tomes Hobbies we gonna get two voodoo dogs and see how this go I can't remember how to bring about the voodoo though if it even still works like it used to I'm down currently a vampire teach mischief spells untamed spells practical spells alchemy Why is he bouncing back and forth across this room? Five hours, Mira, go eat. I'm eating now, but I'm I'm about to go. I need to check. What was I checking though? Um, do 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 do. Or I did depart. I think that was it. I wanted to see if that mod still works. I don't think it works anymore. So because she's a vampire, she can... oh, Who's a non-vampire sin? Already a spellcaster. It gotta be a raw sim that ain't none of that. Mm. Well, I don't think she's <clears throat> If we could get her to stop crying For two seconds 